All right, six feet, going deep. It's Notorious with Skunk Ape Gang. What they do? Mm-hmm. All right, Skunk Ape Gang, uh, why don't you tell us about what you do? Shit. We, uh, a whole lot of gang shit. A whole lot of <laughs> gang, gang shit. Pretty much. Uh, like a collective, maybe? Like, yeah. Like, we make music. So all you guys are like art, in videos. your own individual rappers, but you're just like together. And, like, yeah, we're, yeah. We're yeah. Same shit. We're we're different, same, yeah. different people with different flows. Yeah. So different different music. Mentality different ways. You guys want you can just like pass the phone around pretty much. Well, she just put it right there in the middle of it. Yeah. You gotta hand them to them. No, no, no. I'll talk to them. Yeah. So you guys are like from Miami. You guys are all from Miami, Florida? Or like, yeah. Yeah. Like, yeah. Same, same, same name on the beach. Too. Oh, for real? Yeah. You guys know each other like your like pretty much your whole life? Basically, yeah. yeah. Much, Top yeah. eight type shit. Oh, really? Yeah. My MySpace. MySpace. <laughs> 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 oh, yeah. Well, you guys met on MySpace or like? Nah. No, no, no. no. <laughs> we're, all, we're all from like the same hood and shit, but uh-huh. different ages too. Oh, we, you feel me? We went to the same elementary. He came from New York. Uh, fifth grade. Your fifth grade? Uh, third grade. I knew his older brother, so like I knew him right away. I'm Shout sure. out I, met, <laughs> I met him my sixth grade. Him, I've known since elementary day one type shit. Uh-huh. Him, we met uh, middle I'm, school. He was in. He was I was in high school. school. They were in middle school. school. Uh, and he was. Just, he was. He's the, the youngest. He's, he's the youngest. youngest out of the group. Chico Benz. But he's always been around. Nigga. He he <laughs> actually just started like rapping not too long ago. Oh, for real? And yeah, became yeah. 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 What about what the, um, a year ago type shit maybe? Like oh, I started right. taking it seriously. Yeah. But, uh, but you were like always part of like, the group. Yeah. Um, I mean, kind of like I always chilled with them. If he wasn't rapping with us, yeah, like uh, chilling with us. I went out with some girl, and then her little brother was friends with him, uh-huh. and like, I don't know, in like our neighborhood, fuck, people fuck with us, you know. And then he, I knew like he fucks with our music or whatever. Yeah. And then one of them told me like, oh, he's trying to rap, and I was like, all right, let's give him a yeah, shot. He's from shit. He's a young, like a younger nigga. Yeah, exactly. There's a lot of niggas shit. trying to be gang, but not everybody <laughs> gang. You <laughs> sure gotta be day one. Yeah, like what makes like what makes like you guys skunk ape gang. Um, mm-hmm. Right, well, Skunk Ape is like, they say it's a cryptid hominid. It's like Florida's Bigfoot type thing. It's like, yeah. in the Everglades, there's like mad myths. Like, there's a there's a Skunk Ape headquarters in the Everglades, actually. For real? Yeah, and it's like a thing. Um, pe- a lot of people believe in them. A lot of people have stories, you know? And uh, I, I thought, like, we're all just like ape like. We're all like, Shit, we rare, <laughs> we're all rare like that dude. And we just said, fuck it, Skunk Ape gang. That's what we came up with. Yeah, uh, you guys rock for a lot of ape, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah, we fuck with that shit. <laughs> skunk bait gang. Skunk bait. Skunk bait. That's the new collab coming soon. Like, fuck with it. Skunk gang. So, like, how was it, like, you know, like, growing up? Like, um, like, a lot of fighting. Yeah, like, yeah, we, yeah, yeah, we, yeah, yeah. Like, a whole lot of gang shit. Yeah, like, with each other. Like, no, no, no. no, 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 no. People we beef with, like, yeah. we lost, we lost a life and shit. Like, we have, like, one of our brothers passed, and it was like on some some gang shit type shit. Yeah, yeah they be, like, nowadays you got all these little young niggas and shit. That's even our age, but they just scared to get punched in their face and shit, so they shooting shit now. Oh, yeah. But before that, the way we came up, man, we had some pressure. We'll knuckle up. Yeah, you know yeah. what I mean? Whether it was, it was a fair one or it wasn't, but we was we, we was fading. Sh- we but still, to this day, like, when we go out and shit, it's, we got to watch our back. There's a lot of niggas we got pressure with in the city. Yeah. Well, probably because you fuck their hoes and beat them niggas' ass in the past. <laughs> we still got some pressure uh, on A lot chest. of niggas hate us. <laughs> No, because I know you guys are like more like more of the outspoken rappers, you know, like a lot of like rappers yeah. like mostly quiet, but you guys, you guys no, are like, yeah. more yeah. out there. Yeah, we try. And like I said, like Talk we all from the same stuff. hood, so like yeah. we all grew up around each other, same lifestyle. Like, you guys like playing sports and stuff like together, like yeah, outside? we don't play yeah. soccer. These niggas be FIFA. Like, like we up. play sports, but we never played for like for like <laughs> yeah, the school I, I or shit like that. Soccer. Like we played with I each tried, other, bro. But I got asthma and shit, and they I, told me not. Like I'm nah. gonna fucking lose my life. I'm I remember I used to football. go to the park and shit, like Normandy, and I used to go play basketball. These motherfuckers used to used yeah. to be posted at the benches and shit. Yeah, we wasn't we wasn't the niggas playing sports. We was on the sideline doing. Trapped, <laughs> he has a line about this shit. He goes, "You was always in the fitness. We was just in the finesse." And that shows, like, that shows our shit for a little bit. That shows raw as fuck. Like, oh, yeah, it's hard. Wait, are we guys skating or anything like that? Uh, I skated. We was younger and shit. This nigga, you feel me? This nigga went through. I, yeah, I went through. <laughs> he went yeah, like we feel me. We all went through little phases, yeah. but like yeah. just doing different shit. You know, growing up, you feel me? Get into different shit. But there's always the, you feel me? The, the home team, the seven one thing, and the banging. It was always there. Yeah, R.I.P. Yeah, Reefer. You feel me? Yeah. I was one of the, one of the boys from the same block as us, and yeah. he got killed on the same block type shit. By the police. He was a skater. He was a skater graffiti kid. And like he was graffitiing when he, when he yeah, was, yeah 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 oh, he ran from the cops and they all tased him and he was like on shrooms and all types of shit bullshit but the, the niggas they killed him bro they killed him kid, man. 
fuck? And that shit was like a big movement. Like people still like rap Reefa. Like they don't even they never knew him. You know, it's just like a thing. Like yeah, any that could have been anybody. I could have been any kid doing something bad. Yeah. And just because that area is like that, like they'll fucking kill you type shit. Like it's bullshit. Like, like the police, like brutality. Yeah, problems. exactly. Like, they're trying to get shit like, out of the way. Yeah. We from the beach and shit. Like, I've heard, South Beach. We, I've been caught type shit. We've been caught doing some shit. Um, and they'll literally just say, oh, y'all are Reefa's friends and try to talk shit. Like, for real? that's yeah, how the, fucking the cops and garbage them, cops like, are over yet. They're real fucking tough. Like, yeah. that, shit, mm-hmm. that shit is crazy. And it's like, most of them are that gang That was the main unit. pressure. That was yeah. the main yeah. pressure. The police. Gang unit. It's gang unit. Because oh, okay. like I said, growing up, we're yeah. banging and shit. Yeah. yeah. So, those niggas are straight assholes, bro. Yeah, don't give a fuck about that. Every time they, they see us, we getting pulled over, checked through our socks, everything. And that shit was happening for like... And they don't got shit straight. on us. They don't got shit on us. It's just like, bullshit. But they already, like, they already knew you? Yeah, they yeah. got it out for yeah, us. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Uh, Man, them niggas got pictures. They got us with pictures and shit. Like, yeah, when, I say, when I say for two years straight, we couldn't walk out, like... Could we couldn't walk outside without getting stopped. Niggas was going yeah. to the jack, yeah. we from, you left to right. Over the jack, and niggas was going to All DJ types of Jay, shit. left and right. It's jits, bro, for no fucking reason. Cause he crazy, just want to pull a nigga. You feel me? Take it to jail for a yeah, a little bag. You feel me? They want to be petty. Take it to jail. Niggas get older, you start going to county and all that is shit. It, is it any better now? Yeah, with the no. police. Yeah, because yeah. now they don't they don't have as much work. Cause we was all the fucking trouble. Back then, so now it's like not too many people yeah, we do last, bad shit there. So yeah. it's like yeah. bad people. they don't no, really have they, a job. They made, they made that whole area a lot better. Too, yeah, they don't. They don't have. A they job got like a trolley there. system now. Like yeah. they, got, they got shit for like everybody. Yeah, like, oh, what about like the gangs of like by the beach? That shit, that shit, shit we was dead. the gangs by the yeah, beach. Yeah, but like, South Beach is that shit died in the nineties. Them little yeah, niggas posing and still claiming shit. I don't know what the fuck wrong with them. Yeah, shit, shit's almost done. That shit's almost done. Like. Right, but it's forever there, seven one. There's still there's still gonna be shit like there, but it's not as like huge as it was, you know. Was that was like what was like mostly influencing you guys? That was it? inherited beef. Uh, maybe, I mean, but like of course, like I don't know. We listen to a lot of shit, you know, like yeah. And then I don't know, like we see, I don't know, like being younger and shit, like you know when everybody was into jerking oh, yeah. and like all that bullshit, we weren't into that. Like we were into, like, we were like into like. <laughs> We'll find something else, you know, we'll jam like old trick or old Wu Tang or old 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 yeah, three six, point, you know, own thugs, like yeah. some shit that was just better than that yeah. shit because nigga the, the music was so bad right yeah. there, like in that point in time. Were you guys ever like the ones like to follow any type of trends or anything like that? Not really. Uh I don't know, maybe we start a lot of shit for us, but like, like where we're from, like we're like trendsetters. Trendsetters. Like, 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 you know when Wayne, do shit. I'm not gonna lie, you know when Wayne did that shit when he was like when he was like a rock star type shit, oh, yeah. like I was into that because I like like my background, like my dad and shit, my mom, they jammed that shit, like oh, right. you know what I'm saying? Like I was in my mom's stomach and they were at a Nirvana concert and shit, like there's pictures, like and shit like that, like like I I used to fuck with it, like you know, like I would yeah. I would I would bang with it because it was it was finally something that like. I could embrace. You feel what I'm trying to say? Like, yeah, that was like, like Wayne made it cool to be a fucking rock star, and everybody just followed that. Game. And it wasn't like it wasn't like trying to follow a trend or anything, but it was really like that's where uh, the game was going. Open. It was a door and open it just for went niggas that way. Like, period. You just grow up with idols, and, yeah. and whatever your idols doing influences you. Like Wayne, whether Wayne you big, like it or not, you know, shit like that. Yeah, Wayne's the biggest rapper at the nigga. Hell yeah, run that no scene this time. Oh, I was yeah, I was the same way. No, yeah, Wayne was that nigga for sure. But I tried to be a rock star because I played Guitar Hero. Word, there you go. Yeah, yeah. Guitar, but you feel me? That's not even like that's not even like following the wave. It's just like you doing something that you like. Yeah, it, it ain't even like that. It's all about like incorporating your like, your perspective into what's going on right yeah, now. Yeah, whatever it's that fits you. Type shit. Like, yeah. this is what's going on. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna bring my feel to it. You feel me? Yeah. Cause I, I like what like when you say that you know I, I heard of you guys cause like you guys were rapping about like. Pokemon and Yu-Gi-Oh! Oh, yeah. 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 Like, Yo, so was like, we was like one of the first people doing yeah. that. I, I, I don't want to sound like cocky or anything, like, but I swear to you, when Lavender Town came out, that yeah, shit went that was like... The first, that was the first time I ever heard anyone rapping about Shout Pokemon. out to Ruben Slick, yeah. Metro yeah. Metro's Metro's PG. Yeah, that shit was sort of human. Fuck yeah, brother. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's yeah. fam, dog. Awesome, like, That's G shit, though, when we were young, like we said, we're, we're badass jits. So yeah. we were into Pokemon and all that shit, but we weren't able to get cars like everyone else. So we're out here hitting leagues. I'm talking about like third grade, second grade. Like, <laughs> nigga, we're jits. Bro, so when you would drop all the cards and you'll step on the Charizard. Bro, yeah. The rest of the cards or and nigga, or you'll just rob that shit straight up. Like, just straight up. Like, nigga, give me that shit. Like, watch out. Nigga, it's my card now. 
Like, fuck that shit. Yu-Gi-Oh cards, too. Like, all that shit. I would've hated you guys. I had my cards stolen sometimes. No, I got robbed before, yeah. But it was a cycle, bro. It's like, literally, like, you get robbed and you're like, fuck that. I'm gonna go hard tomorrow, bro. I'm gonna give me 50. I remember I hit a nick on a garbage bag full of cards once, and I thought I hit. I got home, and they were all fake. They're probably all psychic. Yeah, like, nigga, they're all doubles shit. and fakes, bro. Did it matter bro. back then, though? Huh? Did it matter so, back then? Yeah, well, I mean, when you already knew what a yeah. fake was, hell nah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. They were like the Japanese ones. Yeah, I made friends off this shit. I made friends off Yu-Gi-Oh! Like, niggas I still know today, bro. Like, bro. it's crazy. Like, Did you have, like, a dual disc? I wish, dog. I would have fucking killed nah, it, I used bro. To, I, used to be I would have rocked that shit to like school, bro. I would have been honest. This nigga probably had to do this. You yeah, know. you yeah, had one. Show me your tat. He probably tat, had that bro. mention the dice. This, this is a real yeah. nigga, bro. Like, this nigga get anything tatted, boy. Well, oh, shit. Yeah. yeah. Just yesterday, I got Mega Man Sean. on my thigh, bro. Yeah, Sean, 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 Sean Gohan. Sean Gohan. We really on this oh, shit. Sean Gohan. Oh, damn. I don't even think I can pick my fucking tattoo. That shit's all the way down there. Yeah. Bro, he got a Gohan tattoo. We'll take yeah, a picture of Gohan for sure. No, Dev. He has Sasuke right there. You Gohan, Sasuke. The camera, the camera oh, what is that? We can just take a picture, edit it, throw it in. Oh, and then you Yo, have the Squirtle. Yo, show him the Squirtle squad. You got the Squirtle. Y'all niggas sleep. You're like real with that. I don't got no tattoos, but it's coming soon. I already know how I am. As soon as I get a tattoo, I'm done. I'm thinking about getting I'm getting a bunch of shit. Like, yeah, I want my first tattoo to be a neck. Like, I don't even go for it. Like start doing tats so you guys need yeah, Bro, I can't even lie, man. We know. You feel me? People be like, oh, tattoos don't hurt. Those shit hurt like a bitch. Once you get to that thigh, <laughs> like, any Pokemon said, tattoos bro. is that nigga, bro. Because that nigga draws Pokemon all the time. I appreciate oh, that shit. That shit's awesome. Yeah, that's why I awesome. He drew like every, he drew every Pokemon, huh? Yeah. Man, that shit's wrong. That shit's wrong. You guys also? Wait, you drew every There's Pokemon? There's a Pokemon. Yeah, yeah like, he draw like every Pokemon game, on a canvas on and shit. Like, store, like shit. everyone has their own canvas. Like, yeah, this is I mean, if you get good with that needle, bro, I'll get tied by you any day. You can tie all all the Pokemon on me. Pokemon 50 on the back. On my back. What's your favorite Pokemon? Thank you, guys. Gyarados. The shiny one right there. Yeah. That's my shit. Like, I like songs about that shit. I don't know yeah. if I ever had a fucking favorite. Yeah. Nah, I don't think so. I mean, I fuck with Squirtle heavy. You feel me? That's, like, I got that nigga's just that, yeah, 2G. I I my like second favorite is probably like Gengar. I think it's Gengar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, I, I really, Gengar. I love that dark shit, bro. Like, yeah. like all the fucking yeah, like, Umbreon, yeah. like yeah. That Haunter, like all the like, niggas as far as fuck. Like dark shit in general. Well, yeah, that too, obviously. But I'm saying like Houndoom. Like, oh, like, I got a Houndoom and Pokemon Go. I'm so happy, dog. And I pretty much fuck I mean, with like the water Pokemon, hard, you feel me? Bigger. Like, I just fuck with the water, so, like, yeah. I always I always like like water Were you guys Pokemon. playing Pokemon Go, like, together when it came out? Uh, yeah, 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 bro, yeah. we would go to, like... We'll go to um, Bayside, like, Bayside, every day. In bro. the back of Bayside, bro. Camp and there'll be, like, <laughs> there'll be a meetup, bro. There'll be 150 kids, everybody jamming. And one like, nigga would scream, like, we'll scream, yo. Yo, I got a Eevee. And everybody just went over there. running, bro. And it was, like, some shit. Like, right at the beginning of it, it was lit. It was raw. I caught a Dragon Knight in fucking the other day campus. I don't even know where Oh, North? Yeah, I think so, bro. Yeah, this shit's sort of like North. When like, we came in, uh-huh. like, it was crazy. Yeah, this looks like North. Uh-huh. Oh, shit. Nah, I wasn't really like into like Pokemon Go because I was like the, the handheld game. No, of course, mm-hmm. yeah. yeah I was just happy some, like, it was back in a way. Like, it, I don't know. I just thought it was cool, like, for everybody to still fuck with it and be, like, older. Yeah. And just nah, still have, like, that nostalgia and shit. I don't know. Like, I, I, low key, I low key felt like it was fake because, like, because, like, like, I always be drawing Yu-Gi-Oh! at, like, my job. And people yeah. come up to me, like, oh, is that a Pokemon? Like, oh, oh, my God. God. Oh, yeah. That's hilarious. I, I, I seen a meme like, like that, bro. It was the nigga from Digimon, that orange guy. Oh, yeah. And they said, this blue eyes white dragon, the best Pokemon ever. <laughs> and I was like, this is were good. You guys, were you guys on Digimon? Nah. Nah, hell, I hated that shit, bro. I can so tell you, it was just it. so like. I can tell you right now, the only. Like, like, it was just like a bite, and you just knew it was, so you were like, fuck like that shit. shit. The like, only shit I fucked with, like, hard, hard, is DBZ, Pokemon, mm-hmm. Yu Gi Oh! That's it, like, strictly. You know how niggas be into all types of fucking. Yeah, anime. I was in, like, yeah. card cap. They, they turn into anime and shit. rappers and shit, like, nah, like. I only fucked with DBZ, straight up. I fuck with a lot of Naruto, too. No, yeah. I fuck with Naruto, too. Naruto, Naruto is heavy. Nah. That's just like. Like, not only that, but, like, it's not even made for kids, I think, like, you know, like, well, as soon as you get into Shippuden, like, it's more like... Oh, yeah, like adult themes? Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's, there's a lot of, like, shit that's made like that. You ever seen Parasite? Parasite? I, I saw, like... The Maxim? That's just raw. It's, like, bloody and shit. Like, there's yeah. no way that's for kids. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, anime's now for, like, 
P- teenagers and like people even, even like adults like the, and shit. The first Dragon Ball Z because they had blood and everything. Oh yeah, hell yeah! They had to like fucking censor it for TV, tsunami yeah. and bullshit. That's hard. Yeah, first, like, tsunami was hard. Back like back. GT, they'll fucking bust a hole in you and it'll just bleed <laughs> out, and like they'll yeah. just make it purple because it's. Oh, do you ever think that GT was like is like real Dragon Ball Z or you feel it's fake? I feel like GT was. It's nice. It was full. Yeah, it, it's a cool. It, it it's, it's imaginative. It's fire. Like I like it too, but it doesn't really correlate with Dragon Ball. Yeah, because a lot of people were hating. I liked it. I used yeah. to watch it. Hell yeah. Like, you know? like Omega Shenron and all yeah, that shit. Like I thought that was fire, but like everyone's hating. They're like, nah, it's like all about Super. But I'm, I'm not. Oh, really Super is hard. Super is hard as fuck. Oh, Shout out Super. That shit hard. Hell shit, yeah. That shit gangster. That shit. If you don't watch Super and you watch Dragon Ball Z, you'll like Super for sure. Like. That's but not shit. How do you guys like feel about like the whole wave of like anim- anime rap? Like you know, like it, it's cool. I mean, it's it's a uh, it's nostalgic in a way. Uh-huh. But sometimes, I mean, it's like you could hate on it. A lot of people hate on it. A lot of people don't understand it. But I mean, I make shit for what the fuck I'm into. Like, if I'm watching Death Note, uh-huh. I'll fucking make a song and like I, I made a Shinigami song. Like, it's just like shit you're into, dog. That, that's the one that was um in the in the in Sandy the Japanese Garden. Nah, it's uh, it's about like writing a name in a in a book and that person dies. Cause no, no, your name. video, the video you made. Oh no, that was Yembra. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. That, that's about that, like, Japanese that shit. That yeah, yeah, that was hard. That hard. Uh, what, what, what do you guys say like the inspiration for your videos? Mm, shit, I, I haven't know. dropped the video yet. Uh, but like, uh, I mean, we shoot all our own shit and then we edit it yeah, ourselves. We ourselves. We don't, we don't really have any. Inspiration. Yeah, it's pretty much like off of each other. Like, if he has an idea and we fuck with it, yeah. Uh-huh. Do it. What's like, wrong with it? I feel like we really Love feed it? off each other a lot. Really? No, for sure. Yeah, that's that's like a big thing yeah, about us, for real. Group diff. Cause yeah, like he'll drop a verse, uh-huh. and I'll feel like, damn, this nigga dropped a fire ass verse. I gotta yeah. drop a fire ass verse. Yeah. So now we both got fire ass verses. Is it he gotta drop a fire ass verse. It's, it's no nah. competition nah, at all. Nah. We that's feed all, off of each that's other. That's the thing about Skunk Ape Gang. It's like everybody's different. Uh-huh. So it's just like everybody's comfortable with being themselves. So I rap a certain way. Weirdo raps a whole different type of way. And like when it comes together, it's just like, damn. Yeah. No, we can't. I mean, there's no like competition actually, cause like it's so different. Like, there's no way I could rap the same as him or. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's just... Yeah, you guys have your own flow. Yeah, and, and it's not even, like... Yeah, the shit's just raw. Like, like we said, we feed off each other. It's not like, it's not like damn, yeah. we dropped the fire as verse like that. Yeah, Fuck like, it. I remember... Like, like, nah, I like, used to look up to them when I was young and shit. Like, I was like, damn, I want to rap like them. And I used to tell them, like... Oh yo, what's up? Let me drop a song with y'all. Oh, I never believed it. I used to, I used to tell I him like, oh, if you're serious about it, yeah, just do it. Drop something and holla at me. He dropped one song with us. Cause believe it or not, it's a Took lot of niggas. From there on. It's a lot of niggas trying to get on with us. It's a lot of every time I go out, it's somebody freestyling with me like, yo, hop on a track. Yeah, that should be annoying. So it's like it's only so much that you can be like, oh yeah, let's do it. You feel me? Like we don't realistic. If I, I, but they're acting as if we have something to offer as well. Like we're mean, we're on a come are, up. Like yeah, we don't have anything to offer. Like I'm giving exactly. you ten bands to sign for me or something. Like yeah, it's nothing like that. What do you think of like those people that like they go up to like like Soldier Boy and like spit in like shit? You know? Oh, that you, you ever seen that one guy that raps to everybody, yeah, bro? Yeah, he just wanted to twenty one. He'd be like, yo, this one though. Yeah, yo, so nigga, like, me personally, I wouldn't do that. Shit. Yeah, I wouldn't. Yeah, that's no. not me. I wouldn't. Fucking so nigga do that did that shit. to me the other day. Cause I know when. Yeah, yeah, bro, that should be happening, bro. And swear. like, like I said, like I felt like nigga, I felt like I was already up there because of that. But nigga, I'm walking and I got my skunk cape shirt on. But he comes up. He comes up to the group I'm with, uh-huh. and he's like, "Yo, follow me on on Snap on IG. I'm performing at Churchill, slide through, and off rip. I already know what he's on, so I'm dodging him. Uh, Woo. <laughs> I go around. But, but he's a fan, though. I kind of, not really. He was just trying to get on. Uh, but he has a song with him. But I don't. We, I don't know his name. Uh, Whatever. But the nigga comes up to us. Yeah, and he's like, you. he's like, he's like, <laughs> oh, he's like, bro, um, I want to jump on a song, blah blah. I got a song with Chico Bands. Uh-huh. I'm like, oh, I feel you, blah blah. Start spitting a free fight there. And I was just like, what the a free fuck? Free <laughs> stuff, <laughs> <laughs> nigga, for no reason. He's a free is a freestyle. Nah. Oh, yeah. Free, yeah, my bad. I'm over here talking. We have our own slang and bullshit. Like, we right. just but, around here. Yeah, so he's freestyling. I'm just looking at this nigga like, this nigga is serious. I get in the car and look at my homeboy. <laughs> I'm like, bro, this nigga was serious. Like, <laughs> bro, we was literally out at sidebar just hanging out, just having a good time. Uh-huh. Two people roll up, and I'm already like, yo, this is probably going to go down. They go straight up to Candy and spit that nigga freestyle for three <laughs> hours. <laughs> three yeah. hours, yo. Not for real. The whole time that I was there, hilarious. niggas is there freestyling me, oh, telling me, yo, I got <laughs> ideas. Like, like, yo, let's hop on some shit. Like, and I'm just like, Ooh, and it's straight on, and all, but sometimes it gets annoying. Bro, from yeah. niggas from the, like, the we, we got enough on our plate yeah, as it is. Like, we got each other. So not it's saying like, that we yeah. got the most clout, but like, yeah, niggas, like, niggas see, cause it's like. 
we come niggas from we come from like niggas who don't have no type of recognition. Like, like there was never rappers from where we're from that so, are like so me like getting doing shit we do. You know, what about Metro Zoo? Metro Zoo's from uh, you like know, Miami Cokie Shores. Shores, like Miami Shores. So it's like a little bit north from us, oh. and it's like higher class, of course. Like it's yeah, posh. Yeah, you know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, that's why they're like that. Like, is that like Little Haiti, right? Yeah, uh, no. See, like, we're from the. It beach. used to be like Zoo Mansion and shit, which was like, which side. was like lit. Like they had their own spot to like do whatever the fuck they wanted all day, and it was lit. Like, like people would pull up like Raiders and like all that shit back then, and it was dope. And like we're from the beach, right? So like, not South Beach, mm-hmm. but we're from North Beach. We don't focus South Beach. Right. Well, but well, um, what's like the difference between the two beaches? Nah, bro. Well, it's yeah. more like it's more like that. We live yeah. in the community, we and the beach, they live in the tourism. They city. live like oh. in the tourist spots, oh. right by I, Lincoln Road, and they think they're gangster, bro. Like, yeah. so it makes but sense like, to me. You feel me? You would think coming from the beach that like. Niggas ain't that, like no everything's shit. nice. Every, yeah, we're not all shit, nah, but they got section eight all yeah. over the beach. That's where I was raised at. Section, section eight all over the beach. So it's like, nigga, you got a bunch of hood niggas in a nice area. That's all it is. Uh, like, yeah, we have nice scenery. Like, you feel me? We got the beaches. We nah, got, but then there's shit that like there's some like, shitholes, bro. People live there. Like, yeah, there's some <laughs> stuff that's nice. And I'm like, like too, don't look too good. good. But what about like the girls out there? Bad oh, bitches. Bad. Well, yeah. All the bitches bad. All that's all I mean, yeah, bitches. That's, why we, so many, that's why we got so many yeah, problems so with niggas. You get tired of seeing your own hoes, you just walk down to the beach and you're seeing brand new hoes you never seen before in your life. Yeah. It is like that. Straight up. And then we're taxing them on weed, on anything. Right. On anything they want, yeah, yeah. you're getting they super got taxed. Dumb crackers. <laughs> they fall in love with these hoes, then they get mad at us, nigga, because they hoes over here choosing with us. It's not like, like all, the little, the, all the little white girls or whatever, <laughs> high class money girls, they like bad boys, you feel me? So we yeah. was all the, always the ones in the way. At the parties, uninvited, but still up in that bitch. Cool. Getting into fights and all this bullshit. Throwing it up, nigga. All types of shit. The bitches like that shit, I guess. Yeah. You feel me? So then, that's a that's a that's another reason why we had major problems. It was always about a bitch. Where where like niggas like like fighting at each other, niggas yeah. trying to stab each other. Over oh, niggas some stupid shit. You took too much sand, so now you feel you feeling yourself. So now you want to step up. And, Yo, you remember my, my bitch? Face somebody, right? <laughs> no, but it was like when I say like, and this is more like when we're jits. Like now that we're older, we still got beef because of shit we did as jits. Yeah. But like it was to the point that nothing was like ever squashed. No, 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 no. Yeah, no. It was to the point we can't go nowhere because oh, everyone right. hates us. Everybody. We used to go to parties and niggas used to be like, oh, fuck, the there Jack boys are here. There you go. Because we used to go to the party, we'll have, nigga, we'll go like 30 heads deep, no lie. 15 for real. 15 for real. Yeah. Just, I'm for exaggerating with like it. Starters. You feel me? We'll go in, you'll have the niggas, all right, checking out the party, and then you have the four main niggas walking around the crib, hitting the lick. While everyone's partying, the niggas are in the mom's room taking jewelry, PS3s, oh, shit. <laughs> Max when they first dropped yeah, and shit, like all types of shit. Bro. And then we'll be the type of assholes that when niggas will be like, fuck, my computer's missing. We'll be the nigga helping you look for it. Knowing damn well our homeboys down the block already halfway home with all your shit. That's how it fucking was. So everyone hated us on some G shit. they knew it was you? Eventually, nigga. No, I was like... We wouldn't rob anybody we knew like that. It was, like, like that. Just, it was always somebody like, it was like house parties. Like, you yeah. feel me? It was somebody it's, we didn't know, you know? You're in a fucking house full of like people that have shit and people that aren't on shit. So like when we come in, it's just like, oh, those are fucking Nigga, We can't guys. afford that and shit. And we get blamed for everything. Like it's not even Regardless, that. Regardless. It's not even that we live too bad. We get blamed for it, so we might as well take your shit. Yeah, like we'll walk in and people will be like, damn, dog, but... Like, can you guys not fight tonight? And we're just right. like, like, we we're just like, got yo, there. we came here to chill. Like, we just got. I there. mean, if shit happens, it happens. Would you like, guys throw your own parties? Nah, not really. Nah, we really. never. Yeah, we never we had be to. Chilling, oh, yeah. shit. Like, we just be always, chilling on the block, yeah, throwing a pace game. Going on. Yeah. But yeah. niggas talking shit. That's the thing. If, if you throwing a party on the block, we're invited, no matter what. Yeah. No matter. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we're pulling up. Yeah, there was one time some niggas tried to tell us that we couldn't go to the party, and it's on our block. We looked at the nigga and we literally just kept walking. What if, like, what if it was like in. a family party? Yeah, like, oh, no, 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 that's different. That's different. We're, we're not putting up to that, bro. Like, like, we're respectful. Respect like, you feel me? We grew but up. But niggas like a party niggas is back there with fucking um, beer cakes and shit, college homes. Talking about we can't come in and we're like, fuck out of you. Oh, we got to pay. Fuck out of you, nigga. You look at we don't take your money. <laughs> bro, we used to stand outside of parties and charge you. Yeah, like we taking this shit. It wasn't even our party. Not even our party. Oh, fire. Beam, beam, beam. We'll be at the door. Yo, shit. Charging niggas five bucks. Hey, it's five bucks to get in, bro. That's funny. I used to do that with my boy. You feel me? If you from if you from Miami or wherever the fuck in Florida, not even even if you a party ass motherfucker, you know what that type shit is like. You guys are like born finessers. I mean, hell yeah, type, type shit. Like, shit. Honestly, type we just didn't have anything, bro. Like we had to get it. Yeah, like we said, we're nigga. More, I think pretty much all of us here don't are Section Eight type. We still don't got shit. We still don't got shit. We starving. We still got to do what we got to do. We get what we could, how we get it, and that's how we do it. Just like everybody else. Like you feel me? Like back then, I wanted that camera. Like, I'm not saying, like, I'm just saying, like, 
Yeah. On some G shit, like, nigga, there's no way I'm gonna buy that shit. No, no way. Word. I don't got the money. How much is that shit? Like six. Exactly. Six bills? Bro. I don't got six like bills to quick spend three on the camera. On the block. You feel you me? I take that shit quick, drop a couple of videos, sell it to the next nigga, boom, that's it. Quick. And like, shit was pretty savage back then. And that shit was like, and if we like, wanted it, we know that we would still be like rapping. We would still be like, we would still be just like, trying to make something happen for ourselves. Like, you feel what I'm trying to say? Like, yeah. we just never gave up type shit. And that, that's what people would sort of like, like. Cause yeah, I know you guys were like really consistent with it. Cause I was like following music like back then. Like, yeah, like, like, like we still, still, we still drop like, I. I, I just dropped like more now. Yeah, yeah right now I'm on some shit. Now. I'm trying yeah, to drop now, all the time. Now some more I know how to mix and master my own shit. I know how to like really get it to the point that I, I'm happy with my music. Yeah. Back then I didn't have that, bro. Like we would have to pay people, and people would just finesse us, bro. Like you'll pay this much bread, and I'll make it sound like this, and then I'll give you this dirty ass mix, and I'm gonna say it's a master. But nah, like now we know how to do our own shit. They just put like uh, yeah, I mix and master everybody's shit. I make the covers ourselves. Like we do everything ourselves now. Like we're like. We're like a machine yeah. now. Like, we could actually do what the fuck and we, we want to do now. We got two guys. You that's the me? thing. You want a verse? Yeah. Nigga hit Chico Banza. Yeah, like, that's he it. always ready. I, I make, I make, a, I make a song, Crunker, right? And I'm missing Crunker. a verse. I'm like, I could already hear who's on it. I could yeah. be like, you and you. And I send it to both of y'all. One of y'all write something down. Whoever got it. And half the time, the I wouldn't even know who I'm rapping with. We just dropped the verse. He shows right. us a song, and it's a hit. But yeah. I don't know, like, where to put the spaces. Like, what do you mean? I mean, you look at the beat and you just see where it's at. Yeah, like we know exactly, like what, what you know, we know like, what the hook's gonna be, what the verse is gonna be, how long the verse is gonna be. Like we'll place the hooks before like the the verses. So yeah, he'll send me something done. with the hooks. And I have like so right three hooks, the hook, and then there's two verses. So it'll I be keep him going. And then, like, and then he'll jump on it, and the next week he masters it, shows us, and we're like, God damn. Yeah, we, we learned that too. Hit. Like you know, like BPMs, <laughs> and then you just look at it. And you can literally see where the hook is placed yeah. or like something like that. Yeah. Niggas like now, now we got our own shit going. Like you we can actually make, drop all the time. Do you guys make your own beats? Yeah, I started making my own beats. I just made Game Boy on like that tape. I'm getting there. I got like Akuma. You ever heard Akuma? That shows like a no jumper and shit. Like he played it and shit. That shows cool. Oh, that was all, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So that one, I, I made that shit with, with a friend, Killerness. Shout out to Killerness. Uh, yeah, he was dope. What yeah. about um, what about Knight? Knife, that's a beast. That's that boy. Nigga, that's that dude. That's, uh, that's the first that producer nigga. that really like. That really just like fucked it up. Really was shit. fucking with Skunk Kid. Like, like, no, cause like, it, like, I could tell that like, you guys have that dynamic because his his beats are hard as fuck. Nah, yeah, yeah. he be going. And he's he's all the way from Canada, so yeah. it'd be like and for him to fuck with us is dope. It'd as be fuck, the bro. niggas that don't even fucking know you in real life. Bro, I don't even know how he looks. Like, you guys, some G shit. I don't know how he looks. None of that. We follow him on the gram. Like he's low key though. Like he doesn't. I hear a knife beat. Knife beats. It's like. He has his own name and you gotta go find him and shit. None yeah. of his beats is always the That's same. That's funny because there's this, like, this producer I know from Canada too. His name's Eddie Power. Like, I fuck with his beats. Like, Word. I, I heard that name before. I think I showed you him. Word, okay. I, I think maybe, you know. maybe. But yeah, like, I fuck with his beats like really heavy. He's from Canada too. Nice. That's how it is. These producers be like fucking all over the world and shit. Like, I got somebody, like, on my mixtape alone, I got somebody from Canada, mm -hmm. Sweden. Sweden. I got, uh, shit. I got a couple. And it's crazy yeah. how niggas, like, so far away are fucking with us. You guys yeah. been out, like, out, the, um, done this, like, shit out, uh, out of Florida? Yeah. Nah. Out of, like, out the country? Nah. For what? Not yeah. out the country. Like shows and stuff? Nah, no, not yet. Not yet? Mm -mm. See, maybe one day. Every year we get stronger, man. You never know. Yeah. Shout out to Sort of Human. They came down for, like. Isn't he in, like, Illinois? Oh no, Alabama. 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 Alabama, Huntsville to be exactly. Yeah, That's yeah. where they at. I it's like uh, Sor Super and there. like Joey. They're both there. Yeah, they oh. both live there. And uh, how was it like? How'd you guys link up with them? Roy found them online. You know, like when you you're just a troll and you just literally like like this type of Shout stuff. Shout out to Roy, yeah. man. Like <laughs> shit. They call it a talk of and shit. Like like you're literally on the internet, just like looking for what the fuck you like. You know yeah. what I'm saying? And it's like, um, Roy, like, all right, when Blackland Triple Six came out, you know, Perk. Mm -hmm. Um. When that shit dropped, there was a song called Stoner Gang, and it had sort of human on it. And Puya, right? And I think so. Puya was on... No, um, nah, I don't think Puya, because no, Puya wasn't even a rapper. Yeah, he wasn't like even rapping like, it. Nah, like, Perp was already... Like, I think those, he had, like, one early. verse. Like, like nah, hell no. Nah, nah, nah. Not even? Had, um, nah, not even. Human on, like, on his own, like, nah, he probably would, yeah. They fuck with him. Like, sort of Human's awesome, dog. Like, they fuck with anybody who's actually doing something and something dope. Like, yeah. they'll fuck with you no matter what. Like, they're cool as fuck. So Roy, like, found Super online somehow. And hit him up, and Super was just like, yeah, fuck with y'all, this, this, that. Mm -hmm. And it, it, it ended up like, he would work with him, and then we would work with them, and then they came down for uh, the Threats video shoot. Denzel, oh, Simi, Rob Alabama. Banks. They were, they were in Alabama, yeah. They drove and they down came down, just, they drove down for, to go in the video, and 
We all went. To yeah, and we had we had them on a spot to oh, stay. You guys were all there too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We just we weren't in the video, but we were there. Yeah, we were there. Like, yeah. Why not? There was everybody. Yeah, there was like a lot of things going on, and we got there sort of like you said. We're not like wave riders. Like sort of humans on it. Like we were just vibing. We we got there. Some people. We got there for Rob Banks' scene. Yeah. And, I, I and he had, like, all his people with him, and they were just, like, deep out, and we were just, like, on the side. And we were just, like, you know, conversing with everybody, like, everybody who was there, like, El Ray. Like, we weren't there just to Curry, try to be in the video. I, I, we were there Curry, just Curry, the Curry knew us off rib, like, he knows the same shit. Shout out so, Curry. Yeah, yeah, shout out Curry for sure. My nigga Andrew Hill, too. Hell yeah. <laughs> we have a boy <laughs> that he's out in Holland. Uh, no, he's out in... He's out in the yeah, Netherlands. He's in the Netherlands, yeah. In the he's out in the Netherlands, and... Curry was at a show out there, and he like that's, saw him type show. Like, it was just dope. Like, yeah, yeah, it's happened before, and it's just like they went to a par- they was at a party together. They were they were at a marriage went, together. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, like, like, they went to high school. That's all like the that's how like in in the loop with like these people be like it's crazy. Oh, damn. Yeah, it's deeper than music. It's not like oh we know that you rap and. You, like yeah, we never even ask. We, we can't like you know like we're not those type of people to like go ask for shit. Like that's the thing. If the people want to work with us, we we'll work like, with them. Like to like go up to someone and freestyle in front of them. Nah, fuck no, it's it's like I think that's just corny, bro. <laughs> we'll we'll fucking see Too that. Many many like, oh, Skunk Ape Gang, what's up? Blah blah, dap us up and like go up to us, approach us and shit, and like we. We're cool with him on that level. Yeah. Never did, did we say, like, yo, let's hop on some shit. Like, we're not trying to come up off of nobody's name. We fuck with niggas to a certain extent. Did, um, but did Space Coast ever reach out to you guys? Nah. No, but I, I, I have a contact with Space Coast sometimes. Like, yeah. I got beats off him before and stuff like that. Yeah. And uh, he knows our name, for sure. Uh, I remember his first show when he came back from, from New York. Mm-hmm. Like, we were just freestyling Wait, on stage. That? In 2012? Yeah, something like that for sure. Like oh, 2011, 2012. He did a show in yeah. Boston, and some nigga was screaming out our name. Oh yeah, so, so we have. Yeah, so one of our fans was like, "Yo, bro, I told Perp, I told Perp about y'all." He was like, "You don't know about that. That's South Florida shit." Like right. he already knew what the fuck was good. Like you Not know what I'm saying? I had figured because you know you guys, your sound was pretty similar to you know. Like, Yo, the word, yeah, 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 hell yeah. yeah. That show was that show was like. That started like when we when we were making that shit, they were making that shit, and it was just cool as fuck to like, yeah, you know, we correlated against like, we, you know, we're in the loops and shit, but like, I never like completely like just, you know, got a verse from him or something like that or anybody in clan really. But we definitely got to pay homage to Perp. No, for sure, hell yeah. Shout yeah. out to B and B right now. That's just working, man. That's I remember just like a year ago, everyone was hating on him. Now everyone like. I love that shit, bro. That shit just makes him better. All that shit makes him like, like it literally brought him out. From like where he was, because remember he was just like, like maybe like under covers in a way, like yeah. he was like literally like nah, he was everybody was hating on him, bro, and he was just like, like he didn't have a response. He was just on Periscope all the time. I, I don't even know what that is, bro. Yeah. To tell you the truth, you know, I know it's like a thing that like you go live or whatever and yeah. people fuck with you. It's like Instagram live, but like with Twitter. Yeah, I know like X be on that shit heavy and like yeah. niggas like that. Not because I, I had him on Periscope and every second like oh Facebook's person. He's live. always on that yeah. shit. Was, oh man, I wish <laughs> I knew about that. That should be dope. But yeah, he like came from. He came out from under the covers right now. Uh-huh. Made it like I don't know. Do you, do you see like that B and B shit, and like, like everybody's going right now. Yeah, that's what uh, I'm saying. Like he's literally from out from like under the covers <laughs> now. He's literally yeah. like space goes perp again, and he wants to bring that shit back. Like in the interview, he's talking about like how like ASAP was ASAP Rocky was sort of influenced by his shit, mm-hmm. and he was just telling the truth the whole time. And he was saying that when he sees him, he'll want to squash it. He'll want to just be yeah. the same way it used to be. Do you Which think, is dope. Do you think he'll be able to do that? Like, bring that whole, you know, like, bring, bring Black uh, back to the sound? Like, I don't know. That sound is gone. Yeah. They, like, Perp doesn't even make that sound anymore. Perp makes new Actually, shit. Actually, like, the only nigga that's that still kind of on that is Nail. Awesome. Like, no. Like, he still kind of raps like that, but it's, like, yeah, different beats, so though. it's not really the same shit. Yeah. But he still got that same type of flow that he's No, nah, but that's his shit, yeah. That's, yeah. that's what he's good at. That's what Actually, people know him for. A lot of them are consistent with that shit. What about yeah. Denzel? He has, like, you know... He no, switched yeah, shit up yeah. a little bit, but, like, but he's yeah, still, he's still, he's still, still there, like, and shit. And he still has the same content. Wasn't it, like, all, like, the same, like, the QCJ, the T6 Mafia flow? Yeah, yeah. But I don't know. It Like, it is that, but it's more, like... It turned into a whole different thing now. Mm-hmm. Like, you you know Ghost Man? Yeah. Like, he makes that shit that's just like, his triplets are fucking disgusting. Like, it should be like, yeah. like, it'd be that shit that you're like, fuck, bro. Like, that's some other shit. That's not even the same thing anymore. Like, yeah. like the only person who really did that in like 3 6 was probably Lord Infamous. Rest in peace. Yeah, but, that's what, that's but that's what I'm saying. Like, he had like a consistent flow with that shit that'll just be raw. And then, uh, what was I gonna say? Yeah, so he had a consistent flow that would be raw as fuck. 
but it's different. Like, it, 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 it like, changes. Like, you know what yeah. I'm saying? It's like, he'll be more singy, like, and he'll be, like, creep with it. Yeah, but so now it's so not so even so about creep shit. It's about just, like, like, like killing it. Like, ultimate. Listen to ultimate, bro. That's oh, yeah. just a perfect example of how it's different. Like, it's way different. It's considered South Florida now. Like, Puya sound. Like, Ghost Man sound. Like, Denzel Curry. A lot of people Curry. say that. That's South Florida flow. Yeah. yeah. Cause Cause like, that's South Florida way. from, like, other states, they think that Florida is, like, a bunch of weirdos. And yeah. Like, all dark. And, like, they, I think, think it could. Just, it, it, I mean, like, it goes uh, like that in a way. I don't know. South, South Florida is just, just so, they like, niggas, It's them niggas this time. You feel me? There's yeah. hipsters. There's gangsters. There's all types of shit. It's just yeah. niggas, so them it's gothic what, niggas. It's whatever you feel like being, that's what you are. That's what I'm saying. What do you think the next wave is going to be? Shit, shit who knows, man? I say, I say, like, like the weird shit, man. Like the, like the sound that 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 like B and B is on the sound that like GBC makes. Uh -huh. You know what I'm saying? Like that type of shit. Like, like it's darker. Like you know, Black Cray. Like yeah. all that shit. Like all that shit's coming to light now. Like now that it, shit's the the new mainstream almost in a way. Like the way I see it, like what's popular now is either like the dark shit or like you know like Playboy Cardi type. Beat okay, like, yeah, it goes both ways. Yeah. It's either happy or sad. Like yeah, I, yeah. I be seeing memes like Bro, when I go can, find music online. You can say we're kind of like, like, nigga in rain, sad as fuck, or nigga written rage. Yeah. Like you know what I'm saying? Like yeah. it goes both ways. What are you saying? But like you could say like we're kind of like in the like middle of that yeah, shit. Yeah, like, exactly. We could do some dark shit. You guys aren't emo. You know? Yeah, we're not really emo, but then at the same time we could turn the fuck up nah, like on some Playboy Cardi shit too. But are you guys yeah, yeah. more turn up or more lyrical? I mean, I, 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 I say more turn up. It, it depends on. Yeah, it's like the word lyrical niggas. just turns nah, me nah, off. Look, look. look. Yeah, like, I have it. lyrics, but I, I, <laughs> but I ain't lyrical. Like, lyrical. I ain't like, like turn up. Conscious up. rapper, like you know, nah, hell no, nah. I can't. I hate that shit. No J Cole shit. Like you know, like Ski Mas always says that shit. Like I be having lyrics, but I'm not like on no J Cole shit. It's literally like what South Florida is practically like. You can't say that. You that, guys have bars. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Not, but it's not like you're not talking about like police brutality. And yeah, yeah. yeah. No, no, I mean we I'm do, but that, in like, our way. Yeah, yeah. Like yeah. I said, yeah. like that, all that gang unit shit. Yeah. Niggas used to get beat. Like nobody's like, on that, bro. Like, like if you're on me? that, you're 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 literally like not even Kendrick's on that. Listen to his new album, like, and that's the person who used to do that, like yeah. literally, and it's not there no more. Like that's just that content is like. It's sort of like bubbled away. I mean, people still rap like that. It's just like they're not as popular. Oh as no, it's not. Rap. It's not the mainstream thing to do. Or like, yeah, it's, yeah, okay, yeah, you're right. Like Jay Cole still raps like that, right? No, I mean like under, like underground artists. They're like you know a lot of them still rap you know the same. Like, that oh, that conscious shit. Like, yeah, but then like they don't get as much recognition. Yeah, but that's just not us. Shit, yeah, if you put that shit at a show, people are gonna walk away. You know? Yeah, like no, I've seen Joy Badass I'm shows. Yeah. I'm like, that type of nigga that will walk like, away. I I personally don't like that shit. Man, like, that's I fuck with it, Florida, but I can't sit down and sit there and jam to a whole J Cole album because I think I just can't. I need to turn up. What I think is Palm Beach. Yeah, like motherfuckers. The newer the generation. Generations come like the less tolerance they have <laughs> yeah. with what with with, with fucking music content, like really? yeah like like their fucking brain is getting eaten each and every year like nowadays if you're not fucking screaming on a microphone and jumping around they don't they don't fucking jump around to it or they don't like feel it you feel me yeah. like like if you go there and try That's to fucking perfect. say some shit and talk yeah, about like about. positive and like. <laughs> Okay. No, I mean, I feel like level. you can say it like how X does. You know, he he like he spits the hard shit, but then he's like, yo, you know, fuck what everyone says. Like, just like have a speech at the end of it. Oh yeah, yeah. That. That's 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 the way to do it. If you if you want to talk about that, that's the way to do it. Yeah. Like yeah. literally have fucked up, fuck. You feel me? Everybody. more of a. And then you just say, yeah, shit. bro, police brutality sucks, dude. <laughs> and, and that's how it goes. That's how it goes. Like, if that's what works for you and that's what the message you want to put out, go ahead. Yeah, that's, that's I, what I, you gotta I know do. A lot of people like being confused as fuck. Like you know, like, you're like turning the fuck up and then like. You're Yo, yeah, <laughs> yeah like, if it's like that, that's how it goes, bro. It should have worked. Yeah. But we just don't make that, you know? We just never had to do that in a way. I don't know. That's not, that was in your style. Mm -mm. It's like, we wouldn't. Especially like where we're from, like, no one, like how he said, mm -hmm. this is a person that, like, I want to listen to my music, right? Mm -hmm. So, like, I would be myself all day, but I'll never make some shit that, like, would make him feel like he can't jam me. Yeah. Or he can't jam me. Like a person in my gang wouldn't feel it. 
Like, you know what I'm trying to say? That's how we yeah. feed off each other. Chill. Like, I'll show you him a song. Know, you guys know each other's taste. Bro. Exactly. I'll show exactly. him a song and he'll be like, he'll hear oh, a beat. I don't like this part like, right here. This nigga oh needs to be on like, the song. Yeah. This is like a song for this nigga. Yeah, like, these days I literally just be waking up, you feel me? And this motherfucker for me be like, oh, yo, I think you'll snap on this. He what actually did that shit, like, uh, the other day, like, yeah. three weeks ago or something. He's like, yo, yeah, I got to be for you. I think you'll snap on this shit. And I'm actually, like, listening to that shit. Yeah. But are you guys, like, all productive? Like, are you, like, you know, if you send someone something, Mm-hmm. I mean, we tried. Nah, not right now. I'm, I'm but the, we're getting I'm the there. We're getting there. Nigga, no lie. <laughs> not right now, but we're getting there. Yeah. Because it depends. Because you know, like something could sound good with somebody on it. Yeah. But if you send it to them and they think like a month or a year, yeah, to yeah, write yeah. To it, nah, it's oh, yeah. Like, you, like, and you want it out, you want to send it to someone else. Like I remember we did that. Yeah, but that's yeah. that's how it is too. Like we'll send each other open verses, and whoever jumps on it jumps on it. Yeah. Like, like you could claim was, it. But like, let's say, cause like, I'm that type of nigga. I'll be like, yeah, yeah, I want to jump on that, and I'll take forever to write on it. Yeah, no, I, I, I didn't mind. Else. I didn't mind you waiting. I'm waiting on that because I, I, you know, I've won you on that song. You know? No, word, word. But yeah, that shit worked. It was like you gave me a deadline, and you, you know, met it. Yeah, yeah, you know? he, he was supposed to be. Well, <laughs> well, you wanted to be on it too. Um, but yeah, that's how shit is. Like first come, first serve. Oh yeah. <laughs> Do you fuck with it? You never, like that shit? Yeah. That's, that's, that's what we do, actually. Sometimes when yeah. we have a song and we don't know who we want on it, we uh, send it to the Skunk Egg Gang email and be like, who wants to jump on? Uh, really? And whoever, yeah, when it's whoever, everybody comes, whoever got the first first, first uh, yeah. just hop in. And sometimes I'll know he's trying to jump on it, but if I really want to be on it, like I have to tie it up and try to drop that shit and yeah. make a fire verse before he but not, Right now, on. like everybody's <laughs> more con- consistent and like coming out with more shit and we're like literally together now. Like we're literally going in. That's just what, yeah. what was making shit cool as fuck. Like... Literally, like, I needed them on a verse, mm-hmm. and then when we met up that same day, they both knocked it out, ad-libs, everything's done, and I just mix and mastered that bitch, and that's what, th- that was on the tape, it's called Digi Camo. Yeah, we got uh, verses on Go. It's on Sandy, man. Yeah, yeah this nigga's the verse collector. He collects a verse from everybody. Like, every time I'm around, like, it's hard to get a verse out of me, so it's like, yeah. do whatever the fuck <laughs> you yeah. want. This nigga right yeah. So they're like, nigga, do whatever the fuck you want. Get in that booth, do whatever you want. And, like, yeah. I'll drop a verse, and then come, like, a week later, and that shit's on a whole other beat. Yeah. You feel me? Like, <laughs> it's shit like that. He's literally like, like the ghost face of Skunk Ape. Right? Right. This nigga <laughs> always, it's hard to get him there. And then he finally spits some shit. It's fine. That's the best shit. And you're like, why didn't you fucking do that the first time? <laughs> 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 what, were you guys always rapping that good? Or like, what, when you guys Hell started, no. was it like, nah, you know, nah, we're sure was trying. Nah, we honestly, you I mean, honestly, niggas always, always loved us. Like, that's one thing. Yeah, like, no matter what, people are like, when you listen back on it, it's like, you feel yeah. me? Like, we weren't the best. I hear my old shit, and I'll be like, ugh. Yeah, what but, but it's still fire. Like, like 20, nigga. 2010, 2011. 13. Like, no, yeah, 2012, because that's when we was in the T.I. We was in the T.I. 2012. No, me, because I dropped my mixtape 13, and that was, like, the wild no, shit. But when we started <laughs> rapping, like, when we started, well, like, fucking around, it was, like, that's it was, like, 11. It was, like, 11, it was like 11 that's 12. That's that's We called it, like, a little trap house. We had the whole building. Oh, we didn't want to be. Yeah, it was the whole <laughs> they had a generator in that bitch. They li- yeah. niggas lived there. Like that shows that spot. Had, like, you could get room. tattooed over here, a haircut over here, fuck a whole right much. Like, it, it was got my dog Blaze over there doing. The, you feel me? The credit card uh, uh, mm, over yeah. there, and then you feel me when he wanted to get right. You got the chicos. You feel, we was over there selling bud and whatnot. Um, yeah. And then you feel me upstairs. You had the, the, the more of the families. The like, families was upstairs, but the downstairs nigga, you could get a cut by my big brother. He the barber shot. I want you. You get a fucking tattoo by um, you feel me by my sister's boyfriend Eli or or slip. Boy, you remember Slippo? You were hungry, you go next door. You go hungry, you go next door. Go across the street. Go my mama, she stayed right across the street. So we'll be outside chilling, so like smoking. There's like a whole city in there, pretty much. Oh, that was a spot. It was a T. Yeah, it was a spot. R.I.P. the T. You feel me? Shit, I knew about it. Yeah, we got rushed. Never got rushed. After two years, though. Yeah, we were rocking out that shit for two years. It was a, it was a four clothes. Yo, there be Gettys in the back of that bitch. Like, yo, shit was. Nigga, we had a little boat. Cause we, we got like a little water channel that leads out to the ocean. Cause you feel me from the beach in the back of this. So, nigga, yeah. we had a little boat with a little patrol motor. Yeah. Slide out, take holes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Lakes in the yeah. back of other, hitting lakes on other lakes boats. Video and like, shit. Like, crazy. I'm shit right the by best. the water, like where everybody be at. That's, what, that, what that was that spot. Boggy Creeks. I'm like oh. right by the TI, like literally next door, just because I didn't want to snitch the place out. And I'm literally next door and like right by the water, the same water That's they're that, talking the about. The song was about that? Yeah, practically. Sure. Like, All right, so uh, P- Pure Cut, which was Dosage at the time, sent me that beat. Uh-huh. And uh, he was, it was called. No. Candy found a uh, pure cut and like mm-hmm. the song was called Boggy Creeks mm-hmm. and like I literally thought about it I'm like damn this is a fire ass like I was thinking, like he, he named that be perfect like I thought you were like you were rapping about London for real yeah yeah I know there's like a thing over there about that yeah yeah, yeah exactly but yeah 
It was just like, he named that beat, and I looked into it, and I was like, damn, dog, I gotta shoot this shit by some water, and I'm literally like, bro, that's our backyard, like, yeah, why the fuck not incorporate it, and I, like, that's what we did, like, I ended up doing it like that. You know a funny story? Like, you know, like, how whenever um, you, like, want to listen to music, and you don't really want to pick a song, you just pick whatever's all the way at the top? Yeah. Like, my, the song that's always on the top is Abominable Snowman, so I always that's hear that funny, shit the fuck. first time, because like, hey, I haven't heard that yeah, in yeah. a while, So I, I, I always hear that, like, I know, like, the whole song, you know. Like, Damn, that's dope, <laughs> that's Hell yeah, I appreciate that shit. I don't even like that shit no more. Bro. Yo, can I crack Like, I feel like I evolved on that shit. I like that like, shit, like, the last time, time, like, I was just like, where because you're like like one of the, like, the only few people that i like, really was into it you know what i'm trying to say like it like that was into it like oh, yeah the people who are into like i love weird and shit are literally like people who really fuck with me type shit like because that was like early that was my first tape so okay. it's literally like everybody just like yo like this is what we like yeah and then i just keep making shit like according to that you know what i'm trying to say like yeah because like, yeah like i was saying you're, you're yeah. consistent with it exactly what about like the first like tape you guys were all on uh, we did the gang tape. The A B B Y, right? G A N G. No, yeah. no. Oh, well, that was a collab, was first. but that was like, yeah. All with Black all Yang was, was uh, us and sort of human. Oh yeah. And it was. Uh, yeah, that's just fire. Yeah, thanks, Doc. Okay. Appreciate yeah, it. Yeah, that's actually the all the Pokemon yeah, shit. Niggas had, yeah. they had to have me that's, that's that. the, Nigga, I'm only like on two songs, and they had to have, like put me in the headlines. <laughs> yeah, to get them shits out of him. <laughs> and that's when he was at his worst around that time. Nah, hell, nah, he still spit that shit. That shit was fire. Damn, no, I'm, bro, I'm not talking about his verse. I'm talking about getting him to spit it. Oh yeah. Like, yeah. he was at his worst, he like, on at that time, like, you couldn't street find shit. him, or he'll come and get a call and be like, yo, I gotta go, like, bro, that shit was, uh, nah, it was yeah, crazy. Yeah, we made that shit all in my crib, bro, that shit was lit, that shit was nice. And then, I was, like, 2013, and, uh, Sword of Humans don't have the tape, but that was, like, the first time we, all of us were actually on one tape together, mm-hmm. and then it turned into, um, the gang tape, uh, we dropped that last year, right? Yeah. yeah, the, the gang, last one, right? Yeah, gang yeah. tape is like all of us literally just working on one project together, just putting in what we had to do. That yeah. was our first project. Yeah. yeah, and then we're dropping one soon. We all dropped solo projects. Yeah. Um, I got something coming out. Yeah, Maybe the new candy's like fucking news. crazy. And new Chico bands. Yeah, you wanted to say the name? Bands. Yeah, it's called City of Satan. City of Satan. Yeah. yeah. That's just, why, why is it called that? That shit's too hard. I'll let y'all it's know right now. I came, I came it's for up sure with the best name. Ain't nothing but product design on I the came beach. up with the name because, you know, the, the, the movie City of God. No. You ever seen it? No. Where it's City of God is a, you should watch that shit, a favela, that shit. favela, which is like it's a novella. A favela. No, a favela. favela. Like, favela. Like, no, favela's like a Brazil. 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 Like, you know, the hoods that be on top of the hoods. Whatever, it's a favela in Rio de Janeiro, and that's where I'm from in Brazil. And then... Obviously, I don't live in Brazil no more. I live in Miami, so I, I see Rio as a city of God. And then oh, because right now I'm in the city of Satan. They call that because they have the Jesus statue. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. And uh, you gotta watch the movie. That's just hard as fuck. Yeah, far, City of God is beast, bro. Yeah. So, what are, so what are, basically, I'm I'm naming the best shit up. Basically, I'm naming Miami the city of Satan because it's hot as fuck. It's full of sin, bro. Like, it's full it's of sin. Everybody here is mad. Everybody's as fuck. here to make guap. Everybody's here to cut yeah. a nigga's neck for some shit. Yeah. You know? Doing some shit. But uh, yeah, I got 18 tracks on there. All the gangs featured. Everybody. Yeah, at least one. At least one track every member on it. And I'm I got actually a waiting on that shit to drop. Yeah. I don't hear it that We much. got new merch <laughs> coming too. New merch is fire. Can you guys like drop stuff? Can you like send it to my phone? So I can get it? Cause like I see it on Instagram. Like, Where? Like, oh, I'll listen to it later. But like mm-hmm. if you just send it straight to me, I'll listen to it. Word, I got you. Oh, yeah. I be getting a lot. You send me shit all the time. Like, uh, I, always, I always feel the same way. Like when somebody directly sends me something, I feel like it's like. Fuck with me, so like yeah. I, I gotta go do it like right away. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, but like if you see it on Instagram, if you see it on Instagram, like, I'll go look for I'm it. I'm gonna jam later and you forget. Yeah, yeah exactly. And especially yeah. not south. Oh, you lose the pick now, and you just give Instagram, up. Instagram like it's not in like order anymore, so like you know go look, you yeah. go back to look for it and you can't find it. Word. Yeah. So it's like yeah, just send it like straight to my phone. Hell yeah, got you. <laughs> I got some. I got a project coming out next month. I'm gonna drop like merch for it and shit. It's gonna be cool. Like more like skunk, like skunk game, skunk game type of stuff. T-shirts and shit. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna drop more merch, uh, more skunk cape shit. Like, who designed the the logo? Oh, I did. I made oh, it. Did? Yeah, yeah. mastermind. I do like. Draw. I drew it and then I made it like. Uh, what's it? A graphic? Yeah, yeah. I made design, it. Design, graphic. I'm an idiot, dog. Like, I went to school for this shit. And I can't even say it. Went to school. I put it like made on it. Illustrator and like I made it like a fucking. Where you got it? Actual design. Yeah, yeah. I saw. That's all I ever do. Like all, all our covers, like I be drawing them or. Yeah. Or like I make them happen, like on Illustrator, or Photoshop. Do you do you speak Japanese? Like you know what those like nah. the symbols mean? Kanjis and shit. Nah. Yeah, the kanji. Yeah, I, I don't. I wish. You ever try to learn it? 
I try to learn Mandarin because, like, I know it's a well-spoken language in, like, Asia and shit, but yeah. it was hard. I couldn't really get to it. Speak Spanish. I could understand uh, Portuguese and shit. Do you guys speak Spanish? Yeah. 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 Well, he understands. So he yeah, he's Port Portuguese is practically Spanish for like. <laughs> but isn't that, isn't that um, that's Brazil, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah that's yeah. where he's from. Um, what are they gonna say? See, I forgot. <laughs> <laughs> he was like, "That's Brazil, right?" <laughs> well, pretty much, we're all Hispanic. Yeah. Yeah, basically. Yeah, he's Latin, 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 but not Hispanic. We're all Latinos. I don't know if you're Hispanic. Yeah, I'm no. Puerto Rican, Cuban, Colombian. Yes, yeah, sir. Shout out to <laughs> Hank and Roy. Them boys are Argentinian. Yeah, the Argentinians. All right. Yeah. How'd you, how'd you get? Well, Roy was like part of like everything. Oh, uh, Roy was a, yeah. He's, he's the reason he's a, he, they we rap almost. Because I feel like Roy like, does more like solo stuff than you guys do. Yeah, he lives for, uh, a little Roy further now. Roy out every hour. That's but he he's always to, working. Oh, he's yeah, not literally right. working. Nine to five, then he got the crib. Putting yeah, working on the computer. Yeah, he can make you a song in oh, nigga, five seconds. Like, you pay to be here just... He'll go that's off his beast. It. Like that song's beast. Like Roy's basically the like, motivation behind Stone Cold. Swear to God, because, bro. Like there was a point in time, there was a point in time where none of us were doing anything, and it was just Roy with tapes. Roy, like connecting with people. At a point where we were like, yo, like, Roy, like yo, I'm tying up. You feel me? Like, oh, like yeah. yeah. First, first person with a video was Roy, Roy. with Ruben Slick. That was actually yeah. one of the live videos. Yeah, coke in my nose. Yeah. We were supposed to be in that video, but I don't, yeah, for, I don't know. He was talking too much of that blood shit. I don't know. Oh, fair. Yeah. Nah, Wait, shout out to Ruben Slick, shout out to CSP. Both of them. Nah, nah, Roy. Nah, fuck it. <laughs> nah, it was more. Nah, we more. got, look, we got to, we all pulled up after school to, to do the video. Uh -huh. And Ruben Slick's like, yeah, I want a lot of red in the video. You know how that That's what it was. Talk. He was like, I want That's a lot of red, a lot of bloody shit. I'm, I'm, we're we we're not, blood, we ain't bloods. Like, we, yeah. we fall on, under the nation. So Some other shit. we can't even fuck with that shit. So it's like, if, if we well, see. What? No, 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 no. Roy. I mean, the songs with with fucking Roy. So it's Roy don't Roy don't bang, so it don't matter. Oh, okay. But I'm saying like, Rumor Slick was trying to go for that vision, so we was just like, all right, I we'll fall like back, it. we'll stay out of the video. Y'all do y'all shit. <coughs> and then, I mean, we, niggas I mean it's a hit, you know, though. That's just a friend. hit. Oh yeah. I fuck with Rumor Slick. I just hate that it's super blood out. That shit gets annoying sometimes. You feel me? G shit. You can't say this is white. Not nah, just, it's not about that. It's like he's repping what he's repping, bro. Like we can't hate yeah, on that no, at all. We're not hating on it at but all. But we're not affiliated but we're just, with that. We're just not shit. into so that, like, so we can't be in that. It's not our shit. It's like you claiming somebody else's shit. How you over there talking about su this, su that, su that, and then in the video you got a bunch with of with a bunch of cribs. Yeah, nigga. But yeah. Like, you feel me? It just didn't fit the aesthetic of the video. Like he was going a different route, and like we just couldn't be in it. Do you think like other cribs would see you guys and be the part? Not a, it's not about that. It's, it's not like about, about that. It's, it's, just, not a, yeah. it's not even about a gang thing. <laughs> it's just about we don't fuck with bloods and we don't like all that blood shit. So it's like, why are we gonna be in a video yeah, why we gonna that's be super blooded out? Yeah. And we don't. I don't. Then I don't. We fuck gonna with have another person. blood nigga that we beefing with. See the video? Be like, look at these bandwagon jumping ass niggas. You feel how, me? You feel how do you feel about like people like you know like instead of saying C's they say B's? No that's just retarded. Honestly, that's, that's, like, that's, that's all that like, gang. If they if they not if they're actually banging. Yeah, then, that's just cool. Then that shit's retarded. Like, it? Young Thug does it all the time. I fuck with Young Thug. Like, you know what I'm trying to say? Like, yeah, it I depends think. on the person. If the person's actually about what they're talking about, like, it's, it's, it's a, a certain. Here. It's a certain like. If you go to a certain YG neighborhood, does it, like, I mean, yeah, it's not like because you go to a, a certain blood. neighborhood talking yeah, about like, 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 big and bang. Like, people, people use it. Check you for that shit. People use it and they don't, they don't bang. They don't, they don't know anything about that. They just do it because like it's what's popular, what's cool. Like, I didn't have people came up to me talking about wood brat. Yeah, bro, and I ain't even dap him up, like, for real. <laughs> I, was, I was on my way to dap him up, and yeah, I heard him bracking out. Yeah, fuck out here. What the fuck he said? I don't let no nigga call me B, like, bro. Like, nah, nigga, fuck that shit. But, oh, we booling over here? I ain't even nah, nah. We're, not, we're, like crips. we're not like Crips or anything, but I'm saying, like, we don't affiliate ourselves with Bloods. Oh. Now we say like, we're 7-1 Jack, Jack Boys. We like Black and Blue. We bring, yeah, Black and Blue. Some of them is Disciple. Then we are rivals. Like, so what everywhere. You yeah, we beef with everyone. It's EBK. Everybody can. You guys didn't want to make that your name? Instead of what? Um, Seven Jack Boys. Yeah, no, nah, because that's, that's where I'm from. That's a whole different uh, shit. Boy's not in that shit. Right now, Hank's not in that shit. Like, it's, it, that's just it, some of us. You feel me? Like, uh -huh. It's some of the people's lifestyles, but it's not everyone. Like, like I'll fight for that. I fought for that before. But it's not like... It's that's nothing not to do with music. It's actually yeah. real life. Like, that's our life, nigga. That's how we grew up. Yeah, for real. We, um, yeah, going off topic. Do you guys have any shows coming up or anything? Mm -hmm. We might, but it's all in the works right now. But yeah, we have like 
This one show that might might be big. It'll, it'll be pretty cool to do. Just focus on as dropping of, videos. Yeah, right as now. of now, I'm focused on dropping my mixtape, releasing that shit. I got a video that I want to drop before the mixtape. I'm dropping he a has, video too. Yeah, he has his video and his mixtape. Who's gonna be now. doing like the video? Right? Uh, <laughs> it's always like I have I have somebody from Memphis working on it. His name's Wilson. Uh, he also Wilson. produced. Oh yeah. Yeah, he also produced uh, one of the beats on my album too. So shout out Wilson. He produced like two of the songs on Sandy man. He's dope, bro. He be having some shit, and he's he's making music for himself. His name's Sad Boy Flexing. Sad Boy Flexing. Yeah, it's, it's dope. Man. It's hard. I fuck with that. I shit. fuck with young nigga. <laughs> I, I fuck with that nigga, man. Nigga, nigga be barred out or whatever. Any type of intoxication, you start listening to that nigga. I fuck with Drain Gang too, though. Gang. Gravity Boys and shit. Gravity Boys. Yeah, it's like Blady, like Echo 2K. I fuck with. Like it's all the people that are like, like, I don't know if they influence Young Lean because they're older than Lean, uh-huh. but they were making music and then Lean got into it and then like, like they're all like a, like a thing like. Uh, GTBSG is what they call I it. I think it was um, influenced by Rob Bang. Maybe he, he shot it out. He shot it out like Lil B, Lofty three hundred five once, and this one thing. Okay. He loves Lil Ugly Man. He had like this Lil Ugly Man like thing, and he was like my prized possession. You guys, you guys know Ugly Man, right? Uh, no, not personally. No, I, don't know. Or, I don't even know who that is. Seen him perform. That was pretty nice. Yeah, we seen Lil Ugly Man on our block, bro. That yeah, shit was crazy. Yeah. He performed on Seventy First Street, yeah, and that shit was that shit yeah, was yeah. dope as fuck. And Curry, and Curry was there and shit. And then I gave Curry a a cassette to get it signed by Ugly Man. Uh-huh. And he went back there, dog. And when he brought it back, it was signed by Antoine. That shit was hilarious. I was just like, that's dope. Like, I'm going to just keep this on here. This is dope. I remember that day, bro. That shit was hilarious. Because it was a show like Antoine, Ugly yeah. Man, like DJ Dog Dick, like a bunch of people and shit. DJ who? DJ Dog Dick. Nah, yeah, crazy, that shit was dope. Was crazy. Crazy. Yeah. That nigga was making music out of a chair. Yeah, that shit was lit, man. It was like a metal chair. He would just move it, and that shit would make different noises. It was like a Thurman. You know how a Thurman works? Thurman? Like, like you just... Go on top of it and it goes like, mm-hmm. what is that? It's a uh, yeah, it is. Look it up. It's a uh, that's how they do like shit in horror movies back in the day. Oh, really? Like, it'll be like, it's like a like air and like literally, like when you go by it, it makes a sound. So, I'm like, imagining, like a heart. No, oh, but it's, it's literally air. Oh, it's there's nothing there. there. There's no strings. There's not like, it's literally like, mm-hmm. that shit was fucking crazy. Like, like you know, when you mm-hmm. have your ox cord and like, you touch like, it and it goes, mm-hmm. uh, no, like, nigga, like when you blow into a fucking, no, but uh, that's what soda, that shit sounded like. Soda like. Soda no, yeah, bottle, moving the chair. Y'all yeah. extra suck right now, for yeah, real. Ollie. <laughs> 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 Yo, I'm like having so many different images in my head right now. Anyways. Just Google that shit later, bro. Hell no. How long has this been? I don't know. It's been like an hour, man. Yeah, 56 minutes. Oh, damn. Well, that shit's live. How, how long did it mostly go for? Like, the same amount yeah, of time? I, I seen the one you did with that girl, and that was like an hour or something. Which one? Uh, she was like a model. And it was just you two, like, sitting like... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, she, she could talk a lot. Right. <laughs> <laughs> no, people end up doing that. Like, we do that shit, because we're like all sick. gang, family, and yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah. yeah it's more... It's more and we were ranking this nigga story. socks before we walked in. You know, like, that's how we do shit. Yeah, for real. <laughs> You ain't even throwing the white socks, he sucks. He did. What did he talk about? Oh, no, like I was asking him, like, yeah, any questions. Oh, where, where? I had some, I should have wrote down. Like, as you guys were talking. Oh, what's the difference between a favela and a novella? A, a novella is a, a soap <laughs> opera. A so, how do you say it? A soap, soap opera? Yeah, it's a soap opera. Favela yeah. is real it's life. It's a project. Novella ain't real life. Uh, TV. No, yeah, but but tell them what a favela is. A favela is a project. Yeah, like, a favela is a project. Right, you ever seen like, like the hoods in Brazil where it's, it's on, the on top of the hood? Like the higher you go in Brazil, the, the fucking the crazier it gets. Like, the know, worse it gets. Like, like in that movie, um, The and, Incredible Hulk. Like, it was like a documentary. No, no, it's no, no. a real place. Favela? No, a favela is what favela they call that hood. Place. It's yeah. Place. No, it's what you call the hoods in Brazil. Yeah. Oh, like, this like, is a favela. The and this like, is a favela. It's different like, favelas. And, and, yeah. And, 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 Nah. Oh, hey, bro, I ain't gonna lie, bro. I watched that Pablo Escobar one. With no, 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 nigga, I watched hella novella, yeah, nigga, yeah. old girl Dominican. It's a fucking yeah. show. Yeah. I, watch I don't watch them personally, but my old girl watches that shit all day, every day. She gotta be home at a certain time to watch that shit. My mom used to fuck with Pedro Lescamoso. I don't even know what it's really about, but it's like some Colombian ass shit that like, everybody in that time fucked with. I used to watch one on Mundos. It was called, um, that, um, fuck. I forgot what it was called. It was like, um, Desperate something. 
Desperacy. I forgot what it was called. Desperacy. Like, <laughs> 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 no, nigga. I was thinking so much. It was about these cowboys and these cowgirls. It was the three brothers and the three sisters. And they they all, they all start like they all got with each other and shit and like the two parents they didn't like each other and it was different and shit. Nah, I seen a couple. Nigga, I seen that shit like six times throughout my life. All I knew was that Hispanic, bro. Yeah, growing up Hispanic, when that shit was on, you do not borrow. You don't bother your mom, bro. You can't ask shit because you feel me. They miss it. They miss out. There's no like. You got like Netflix. You can't go back. Once that shit plays, it's gone. You gotta wait till twelve o'clock at night to watch it. Seven o'clock, I'm out. I'll be back at nine, nigga. Fair shit, because she got two novelas to watch. I feel that way about like anime, because you know, like you gotta read like the subtitles. So if you miss something, like, you're, like oh, right, yeah, yeah, shit yeah. though. The other day I was watching. I watch, Naruto, I watch all my, my shit like sub. Missed like half the episode. I don't like dub shit. shit on my phone, bro. I swear to God. And, and you don't feel like the same feel. Like, I don't know. I, I know people who watch Naruto in English. Like you know, like I dub. Sure when I was like little, and I was like, nah, bro, this shit's not the fucking I same. Mean, it's so yeah. little kiddish, like. Yeah. Shit, I ain't gonna watch it. And then dub is like, it literally be like, this is my ninja way, bro. This is that shit. And in English, it'd be like, I like cheese or some dumbass shit. Like they literally just like dumb it down to like, yeah, that's for little kids. That's okay. What the cartoons now? That's no, anime. Like, yeah, like most of the time, the subtitles be like way longer. Nigga, the subtitles than it is in they be putting some real ass shit. Like you, you read some of that shit and be like, damn, I'm about like, to yo, change my life. Like, buddy, buddy, <laughs> buddy's, like buddy's really about this, right? And then in English, it's literally like this man way that a ninja does things. Like, believe it. And then you're like, what the believe fuck? it. Like, Oh, believe it! Oh my God, I want to fucking kill myself. <laughs> Do you guys watch like any like um like what about growing up like what were you guys watching like any like ninety like shows? Uh, Gundam Wing. I used to watch Full House. I was. Yeah, I used to watch was, Sailor Moon because it was nigga, right nigga. before Dragon Ball Z. Oh, yeah. So whenever it was on the TV, like, that I was on. Yeah. yeah. I was but on, like, that shit was Cartoon Network vibe. Like you feel me? The TV Rocket with no cable. Like as a child, Rocket Power was gangster. Rocket Power was cat dog. Judge Mathis. Judge Mathis. Sneaky in the brain. No Jackie Chan. Nigga, no cable. Oh, the talent, the talisman. Fuck out of here, nigga. Yeah, yeah. I like the old SpongeBob though. Yeah, Hell yeah! I, I, yeah, I, I never even. Wow. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't see any new ones. I used to watch a lot of Scooby Doo. Like classic too. SpongeBob. I ain't gonna lie, bro. Can't believe I forgot that one. Scooby Doo was gangster with it too. I used to fuck with that shit. <laughs> I remember I used to give that shit late night, and I'm not give like Rocky and Bull. I used to stay up late to watch Family Guy. You feel me? That shit come out like at 12 11 o'clock at night, like Adult Swim. Bro, I totally forgot what you were talking about. South Park. South Park. Oh, South Park is gangster. Hell yeah! My old girl, like my old girl, my old boy, they don't speak the language. If they really knew what I was about, I mean, like being in love late, like that. That you guys. The thing with us, we're no. always on the street, yeah, so like, yeah. so, so they rather us to be keep home. Us inside, it was bro. good enough. It was good, it was good enough. enough. So Shit. like, as long as we were home by, <laughs> let's say like, for real, you know, like, you got a curfew, it's like nine o'clock. Like, you're a gym. Gym. like yeah, for us it's like be home by eleven, nigga. You come home at twelve, that's a little too late. But at the same time, you're inside, you're good. You what can stay the, up, just make sure you wake up for school. Yeah, yeah, on the beach, there's actually a curfew for like. Like, if you're not 18, you can't be out after, like, 12 o'clock. Yeah, but they started that shit after a while. No, we ain't never really We used to be out really this late. Yeah, yeah. Six like o'clock us. in the morning, niggas still on the block. Yeah, think, yeah, yeah, think yeah, about yeah. it. We're, like, nigga, 13 years old, 14 years old, on the block, thugging to, like he said, to, like, niggas, 3 in the morning, doing nothing. Out. Me and Kenny would go around Going trying home. to steal food at night and yeah. shit. Like, <laughs> we were up, like, we were fucking, like, Doing rats, dumb shit. Just out, like, doing bad shit. Like, stealing shit and, like, writing on shit. What do you guys think of Take Care 47? Hell yeah. Oh, Who wait? The, but, oh, that that we that was talking about that the race. That shit? Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. That shit's actually crazy. I mean, that's raw. You feel me? Shout I out to that nigga. That. Who the fuck, fuck with takes that. a video right next to the water poster smoking a blunt? Like, yo, we already know. You feel that's me? Loose. Like, that that's dumb dudes. He's doing real last time, but. How much time is that nigga doing? 30 something. God damn, boy. Did he get life? No, I thought he got the death penalty. They were supposed to do that death penalty. Yeah, because he was like promoting that. He killed them shits, ain't it? Yeah. Yeah, nigga, so literally straight, he, straight up murder, nigga. Right. Like that's not no. He that's, did the race, that's what bro. we tried not to do, dog. Like, you feel me? He did the like, race. put it on camera with your dumb ass, nigga. For real, nah, I like nah, it. Niggas a beast. Yeah, for real. That's like saying we left those parties with all those masks and PS4s, and we're, and we're, we're like, on camera, hey, yeah, like, like, you know, on, on Facebook, got, like got yeah, this new we phone, just hit a party with Venetian. But that was like, <laughs> <laughs> before, like people would go on Facebook and like, yo, I just took all this shit, and they would get. Yeah, they would get caught. You ain't see all these people like doing all this shit on Facebook Live, like niggas be over here. Like uh, murky niggas on Facebook Live or Instagram Live, like oh yeah, you already know I just got this new forty. Bro, I be thinking twice before posting, bro. Yeah. me nah. smoking a blunt. I be thinking twice about that shit. Nah, these niggas, niggas doesn't die in themselves, dog. That's what I the internet's here for. Bro, bro I, I seen, I seen, niggas, I seen on World Star, some nigga did that. He was on live flexing money at the trap. Oh yeah, all of a sudden yeah. he looks through the nigga window. Got rushed. Nigga got rushed. Nigga on live. 
Yeah. MF Doom got a song called Rap Snitches Knishes, and it's yeah. literally like people like giving themselves up practically in court. Like he'd be like, that shit's raw, bro. He'd be thinking about some shit. Yeah, you, know nigga. Funny, you know what's funny about MF Doom? Huh? Like he was on like I was trying to eat healthy, right? Mm-hmm. And I was trying to like cut some stuff out, but I didn't really know how. I forgot what lyric he said, but I had heard that like a song, and he told me exactly what to do. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot what it was. Was it on Um Food? Was it? No, For no, sure. no. It was. It was on. Rhyme, rhymes like dimes, I think. Oh, yeah. Like, I spit rhymes I forgot, like dimes. Yeah, I forgot what it was, though. But it was like, I was like trying to figure out, like, yo, what should I do? And then like, I, heard that, <laughs> I heard it. Like, he said something. I was like, yeah. that's, oh, that's what it was. I, he like, pretty much told dumb. you drink more water. That's some dumb shit like that. Like, like, you feel me? Like, you said some shit like that. Like, damn, you right, yeah, like, bro. Obviously. Like, you feel wow, me? Like, man. damn, that's what I gotta do. Drink no, it water. should be happening like that. Like, that's, a, that's like, I don't know. I think that's magnetism and shit. I mean, like, I've been thinking yeah, of some yeah, shit and it literally yeah. happens. Like, I was literally like, yo, we need an interview. I was talking to him about it. Wow. And then, like, literally two days later, you're like, yo, you guys want to do it. It happens a lot. And that's I was like, the law of attraction. I remember one time I was like, yo, we all gotta start getting on it. We gotta start doing shows. Beam, like, two weeks later, we started doing more shows. And there was, like was one month. time, yeah, there was, that, there was like a month that we went like on a little Miami tour. Like, <laughs> like yeah, I swear, we hit every like spot to downtown, back. Like, type we, even came, we, we was even out here in Kendall. We did one yeah, of the things. Yeah, we did one in Kendall. I didn't go lie. I remember back in the day being like, in the crowd at the show, <laughs> yeah, that's on that's, the stage. Nigga, that's, me, like, that's for y'all to know. This nigga was in our crowd at our shows. Now he's gang and he's the fucking. Mm-hmm. Shit. That's a point, he's a superstar right now. Shit. Chico, yeah, yeah, Chico Band. Yeah, shit, you know? right? And niggas get Chico <laughs> banded on blocks. <laughs> Watch out, fool. <laughs> I, that. Nah, I, the, I know how you feel because like one time um, I went to go see Rob Banks at um, at the hangar, and then like Wi-Fi Spooner was opening up for him. Or, and I was mm-hmm. like, oh, I want to you know I want to open up for Rob Banks one day. And then, like, the next year, on the same exact day, I yeah. opened up for Wi Fi. Hell yeah. yeah. That's lit. Nigga, I mean, that's we opened move. up for gunplay, nigga. And we used to, oh, nigga, we used yeah. to be on the block, nigga, making Yo, money for this hard. nigga, bro. Jumping out on niggas, listening to this nigga, bro. In the like, awesome G shit. We'll be in the T.I. Tribe. Bro, 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 No, nigga, be That's what I know what I was jamming to, nigga. I'm jamming to a cigar fair in hardware. No way I'm gonna start here. Crack the top. Of the four loco. Nigga, we've been jamming to this motherfucker. That's the heart. That's the rock. Coco. Huh? Miami, nah. be on Love he should, dog. He nah, should've. He, nah, but he's too, man, he's too <laughs> thorough, bro, for that shit, bro. He need to get his money, nigga. <laughs> nah, that makes him money, bro, and that makes him more of a star. Fuck that. He's Hell a character. Yeah, he should, bro. He, he's, that nigga's yeah, he's funny as fuck, bro. He should, bro. You know, he saw, he's a nigga. typical Miami nigga. That's Straight up. Nah, when you think of a Miami nigga, you think of Gunplay. I, I was thinking rip. class here, and like my Your professor showed him one of my videos with my boy, and he's like, why is this white kid rapping like he's black? <laughs> <laughs> that's dumb, bro. Like, nobody yeah, that's, can that's dumb act for race, color, by yeah, like, voice, when it comes to that I don't know, I don't like that shit. Real ignorant. When people do that shit, it's just like... That shit's real ignorant, bro. No matter black, white, Hispanic, it's dumb as fuck because you get upset they call you nigga, but then you go call him a cracker. You feel me? Yeah. Like, ugly Hispanic. man, you ever heard? He's when, Hispanic. When, when I first heard ugly man, I didn't know what color he was, kind of and I thought that shit was awesome. Like, he literally just made music yeah. just being this person, being this persona, like being a little ugly man, instead of it being like, a, a white guy who used to be in a sound band because that's what he is. Like, yeah. And he just... <laughs> Like, he rapping as if he's this person, Lil Ugly Man. Like, I respect shit like that. Like, uh, when Eminem is Slim Shady, like, it. he's not being Marshall Mathers. He's not being a person. He's playing this person that he is in that, in that thing that he's doing. You know what I'm trying to say? Yeah. Like, and that's just cool. Like, I, I don't think, like, people could say, you sound white or you sound black. Right. Like, or you're trying to sound black. Like, or yeah. you trying yeah. to sound white. That's or this shit. You feel me? Because you don't see us Hispanic saying anything, nigga. Because everybody swear they got a, a plug that don't speak no English. Yeah. yeah. Everybody's <laughs> plug is one. Everybody's yeah, plug is <laughs> Yeah, like, get the fuck and out of here. We there. We there. We got you. Hit <laughs> <laughs> yeah, me up. Shit, don't That's nobody say know. nothing about that, you know? Or, like, I had a black girl tell me once. She's like, well, she wasn't from Miami. She was from, like, uh... She was from somewhere uh-huh. that, like, when you say nigga, that's really racist. Yeah. But I, like, I told her straight up, I was like, I honestly don't give a fuck. I'm from Dade. We say nigga. <laughs> if you don't like it, you that's can tell so any cool. nigga stand up. I told her just like that. She's like, but if you say that where I'm from, you're going to get popped in your mouth. And I'm like, all right. I'm, but that's the thing. Like, if I'm out there, I'm not going to change who I am because. Do you, yeah, do you guys feel like that's like, what you say? Because, like. Yeah, yeah, shit, nigga, we both minorities. Like, I feel like yeah. we I feel all like minorities. My whoever nigga. feels comfortable saying that shit, then say that shit. Like, like I never had, a, I never had a black, a, a, you feel me? Like a black guy come up to me, be like, yo, why, why, why are you, you saying, saying nigga? That? Like never in my life. Like it's cause like it's, a, it's like our culture. Anyway, it's culture, bro. Like, it's, it's like, like what we do. Like, well, especially in Miami, cause like I said, like nigga, 
<laughs> we say nigga for everything. You feel me? Like, like, it like just, oh, look at this nigga over there. It's, it's like, like white man. Look at this white nigga. Yeah, like, like, this never, nigga tripping. You, you never heard that? There. I know Nav is going through that right now. Nav was talking about oh, yeah. that he's going to stop saying it. And I was literally like, if you feel comfortable saying it around your neighborhood, if you feel comfortable saying it to somebody and they say it to you, it shouldn't be that way. Like, you know what I'm trying to say? Nav has a big audience, though. Yeah, yeah, I understand that, but yeah, nigga, people like that. I, yeah, but, I like that because like, if you don't like me because I say nigga, like, then fuck you. I he's getting like head outside the toys of Russ. Like, who the fuck says shit like that? Like, that's just like, dope, bro. Like, I don't know. I feel like the people that listen to Nav are like a little more sensitive. So I feel like oh, okay. Like, yeah. like he makes sensitive music. You know? But everybody's sensitive right now. I remember I, I saw some shit. Well, somebody told me there's a thing called Dream Defenders, uh-huh. and uh, they, they do cool shit like around our area and stuff like that, and like. It's bigger than just our area, but you know they do real cool shit for for like uh, the youth and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. So what they did is uh, they had this thing, and somebody was telling me about it that Dave Chappelle did like a stand up or something, and everybody was trying to stab at him about it. What well, the, like, the transgenders, right? I don't. I'm like not that? sure what it was. I'm not sure what joke it was or anything. But uh-huh. they were talking about how how people are way more sensitive now than they were back then because he would have made that same joke back in the day. And everybody just laugh about it and be like, yo, Dave Chappelle's a character. I just feel like nowadays... But nowadays people just feel hurt about it. Everybody, yeah, like everybody, everybody, everybody getting softer. I won't even lie. Like, I, I felt like kind of victim to it because the other day I was at my girl's house and we was watching like, um, like Eddie Murphy stand-up comedy like, mm-hmm. in the 80s. And he was like, oh, that faggot got AIDS. I was like, oh, shit. Like, but he was like, he kept going like, oh, this faggot, this faggot. This faggot. I got a yeah. gay uncle, bro. You call him a faggot. Is a rep. And this nigga will beat the living shit out of you. Bro. But his really? uncle will call somebody a faggot. Bro. Yeah, he yeah, calls his boyfriend a faggot. faggot ass nigga. <laughs> because it's literally like, okay, the faggot is a, I think faggot is like a derogatory term. It means something bad, you know? Yeah. But being gay isn't bad. We're not saying being gay is bad. But when you call but a gay mean, nigga a faggot, that's like, yeah, that's that's like so calling a black guy the N-word. Like but I'm guessing, N-word. I'm guessing me, like, just like blacks that. or whatever the fuck you want to call it. If you're black, you can say nigga. Or if you're gay, you can call another nigga a faggot. Yeah. So I guess that's My name's weird, Weirdo, dog. And I'm with all the weird shit, dog. If you like a guy, fuck it. You like that guy. You like a girl, you like a girl. Fuck it. Like, you got to be who the fuck you want to be. Yeah. Being weird is cool, dog. Like, why the fuck is it cool to be normal? Like, yeah. what the fuck is normal? What the fuck I mean, is that? Like, it's just there's no, like, real yeah, thing to it. You know what I'm trying to say? Like, that's what you're trying to say. There's no, like, yeah. straight line that you have to follow. Like, fuck that. Like, that's just not... Cool, Honestly, like, just be who that. you are. You be a rebel, dog. You, if you have who you to, you want to be. It's and not that's even it, about bro. being who you like, are. It's letting it, like, like you being comfortable with who you are. Exactly. Because yeah, exactly. You're gonna either show it, or you're gonna not show it. But guess what? You're gonna do it regardless. Because yeah. It's yeah, without my opinion, so, fuck my opinion. Yeah, you're gonna do, do what you wanna do. And it's like you know how some people switch up when they chill with a different crowd and shit. Like, we're not like that, bro. We're yeah, exactly yeah. how we are when, when you guys be when we're together. I could be nigga. I could be in the, in the principal's office. I'ma still be fucking candy man. Boonda, candy man. You feel me? Nigga, I could be like, like yeah, yeah that's actually I mean, like, like how, house, house, how that I was saying shit, earlier. Like, like, well, I think house. he said this. He was like, "Where we're from, we're trendsetters." Like, dog. So this day, I remember shit from when I was in ninth grade. You feel me? I would go to uh, our homeboy's crib when he used to live on 74th Street, and we used to go upstairs and he used to be like. Gang, got spooked and shit like that. The, like we yo, still say that shit to this day. Like, shit, like yeah. we just make up like, like you know, our area like, and everybody like, just does it because it's like a thing. And it always like, evolved just, from something else, but like, yeah, it's like it, it starts getting dumbified. Yeah, yeah. It was like scared was like it got it came it was from, from I got scared. People got spooked. People literally be copying it so much that we have to switch it up. Yeah, like, like nigga, we come up with something, something we have to switch it up, and then it just turns into something. Yeah, else. like something that's unbelievable. We, loop, we, like, we, we use it in our music too. Like there'll be some things in our music that it's just an inside thing. <laughs> everybody just fuck with it because it's that. But it got to the point that nigga, we went to school like the next day, the next week, huh? and nigga, everyone saying that shit, and it's just right. like. We're like, damn, so I we said, fuck it, fuck it. We and stopped using it in the shit. wrong context. We come up with some other <laughs> shit. Same shit, way, nigga, a week later. Yeah, everyone in school saying it. Like, we don't care about that shit, but that shit's funny how that shit really like, happens. A, like, like, about a year and a half ago type shit, we had, um, we had this one guy that we knew, you feel me? And, like, basically, where we, where we were all, like, trapping it out of, we were calling it the trenches. We were like, oh, trenched out, trenched out. And then I promise you, bro, like, in less than, like, five days, Four days, everybody was talking about, oh, yo, trenches, oh, yo, you get the hose to the trench, oh, yo, trenched out this, and I'm just like, like, damn, You you came through, you (laughs) bought a little bag, and you smoked with the gang one time, and you think you trenched out. I swear, (laughs) bro, like, what the fuck? And then get on, nigga, you don't even know the door, you don't need the the code to the door, you don't know it, bro. Yeah, we had this little, you know how, like, there's there's some locks that you put on the door, you put the code, and then it unlocks itself? Yeah. Like, we had one of those. Yeah, so if you was knocking on the door, you ain't even gonna get an answer. If it was like a customer, all right, then you probably get an answer, but... 
Well, if you he was from there, you just open the door. I mean, let's, let's answer questions. I don't even know. Like, I mean, like honestly, if you ain't know the code, you would have to knock. I mean, like, not knock. You would call have to somebody. call. Yeah, you'd be like, yo, I'm outside. outside. Whatever. It's just like an inside thing. If you knew, you knew. If you didn't, you weren't yeah. in it. That's yeah. it. Like, it's pretty much if you were a gang, you were a gang. Yeah. I remember, yeah. like, Russia. back in the day, like, we're, we're talking about, like, inside things or whatever. Uh-huh. Um, we used to, like, freestyle, every, like, at lunch. I used to freestyle, like, every lunch. Uh-huh. And, like, I'll have somebody a beatbox some, or something like that. You know, like, we just used to freestyle. And Roy, Roy would be around it. And Roy would never freestyle, but I knew he could rap. And... Well, like, this is how, like, practically Skunk Cave, the movement or anything, even started. Like, Roy bought a mic and a fucking MacBook. Not even. He just had a MacBook, bro, and he would just rap to the side of it, and it would just record songs, dog, like, on GarageBand. And you were, like, the static and stuff coming out? Practically. Oh, and then we didn't give a fuck. It was, like, cool. Like, oh, shit, hell yeah. yeah. We're dropping tracks. Like, <laughs> and, like, at the time, he, he didn't have me on a song, and he already had, like, 20 songs. Yeah. And I was just like, yo, I gotta get on a song, dog. And it was, this is, was, like, my senior year. Yeah. And I'm like, yo, I gotta get on a song and shit like that. And it just turned into like a thing. Like we would just meet up with Roy and shit and like find the stupid beat to jump on and just get it. Like and then it turned into buying a mic and then it turned like you know, it was a USB mic and shit like that. And then like when I started buying my own shit, I found out about having an inbox, having shit connected the right way, like yeah, an XLR. Yeah, exactly. And then like that's how we started like evolving into like more of like a yeah, a collective and shit. Yeah. But it all started like on some inside shit. Like if yeah. you knew where we were rapping at, you would just come at lunch and shit like that. Like and if you knew the person beatboxing, you'll tell them how to go like fast or slow or something. Yeah. And it that shows cool, man. Like that shows the yeah, practically the beginning of skunk cake Anywhere, shit. anytime, like we're at a party. Shit got a little boring. This nigga was already freestyling and had the whole party jumping. Shout out to Marlon Cruz. <laughs> There's a video on Vimeo and it's, you know, Marlon Cruz? The, the, the artist? Yeah, yeah, the artist, he was... Uh, he did my, my art cover, by the way, for my mixtape. Oh, I think I saw it. Shit was too it. hard. Yeah, it's, it's me like, like that. At the time, oh, he was uh, called Young Link. So Young, Young Link. And he was part of CSPG. Like, oh, he was a rapper? Too? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, boy, so I it's a rare-ass freestyle. Like, it's me and him going back and forth in the back of some party on the block. And that shit's raw as fuck. Like, it's just some rare shit. It's like rare Metro Zoo, Skunk Cape Gang Freestyle or something like that on Vimeo. Oh, I think I've seen that video. Yeah, it's just like, it's dope as fuck. It's just like some old shit. Just to show you like how funny shit used to be. When you guys like freestyle, do you ever say like some gay shit? <laughs> nah, nah. nah. <laughs> like, nah. I feel we'll like, say some dumb shit. But we'll say yeah, dumb shit. But not no gay shit. shit but oh, yo, alright. You know when you're freestyling, you just keep going on some shit. Yeah. We made up some shit. Like, we'll just like if you ever said something really stupid or gay, you'll just be like, "But it's opposite day," and then you just like <laughs> you just take yourself or some shit. Yeah. I remember we did that for a minute. But it's, I remember that the opposite. <laughs> you remember day? Like, yeah. yeah, but it's opposite day or some shit. Not because a lot of people they're scared of freestyle because they're gonna they're like down. What if I say something gay? You know? <laughs> I, 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 mean, I never heard of that. Bro, who cares? At the end of the day, who cares for real? Because if you're not gay, if you're not gay, if you're not gay and you say something gay, it doesn't mean you're gay. You know I what I'm trying to say? Like, people think you're, you're gay. It depends what you said, too, honestly. It depends nah, what you say, but I doubt some, bro, some niggas going to say some care, shit nah. like really gay. <laughs> Like, you feel me? Like, yeah, like, for you to actually, like, <laughs> let it, like, slide, like, and you literally have yeah, to, like, like if you say let it slip utterly, by like, accident. Gay, like, like, whoa, dude. Like, <laughs> like, like we I gotta thought stop about you like, last week. Bye, bro. Bro. <laughs> All right, yeah, you did. Yeah. Like, I'm pretty sure the person will stop himself. Like, but nah, this, like, Eminem does some shit too. Eminem will say some gay shit, and it'll just be like, everybody just lets it rock. Then, yeah, yeah, yeah. Crazy. Knowing how we are, we'll just rank the nigga. Like, yeah, we'll start yeah. ranking him, and then that's the next it. nigga starts freestyling. And that's or if it, you start fucking up, you start, you literally just pass it to the nigga next to you. Nah. But we never said some shit. We really care. Like, honestly. If you want to say some gay shit, and you feel insecure about it, then you need to do some self reevaluation to see. Who you really are inside? Are you this or are you that? Because if it bothered you that much that you said that, uh-huh. then this probably is you. Because I feel like uh, the thing that a lot of people say. Because I hear a lot, you know, I be on you know, freestyle and cypher and shit. Yeah. A lot of people are like, oh, I be fucking all my niggas, you know. But it's like, yeah. yeah, you just fuck with your niggas. Yeah, but, but yeah, doesn't mean you fuck all your niggas. about when you caught flat dog saying that shit? Oh, this nigga said, oh, is my hair longer from the back? No, no, <laughs> nigga, no, not that one, dog. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are ass. This nigga was like, yo, look at my hair. <laughs> no, it wasn't my <laughs> hair. Nigga, it was his <laughs> hair. No, no man. I'm Before you cut it. it. It's a video, fool. Oh, no, what's the longer hair? What's the longer Oh, like, that I'm, I'm recording a verse, bro. Yeah. And I say... Bro, I say some shit like, no, what does he say, fool? No, you nigga. remember. Nigga, it was in your crib. I said I know, it. I know. And I literally turned and said, oh, yeah, because I... 
Before, oh, no, that, that, say, was, no, that was some fucking around shit. He said, remember bro, when he said some shit like, about, like, like, fucking niggas or some shit. Yeah, like, but, like, I meant to say <laughs> fuck nigga or some shit like that. Like, you feel me? But it yeah. came out that I said I fucking niggas. <laughs> and then I said, oh, yeah. I looked at, I looked at the camera because I knew they were recording me. And I was like, <laughs> yeah, because I fuck niggas, right? And I was like, damn. Uh, and they caught, like, there was no way around it. They caught me. There was one time that, like, it was like, he was doing, he was doing, like, some, some background ad libs. And it's literally, like, it's like, he's just something about 12, and he's like, fuck them. And then he just says, like, it's just something about gang. He's like, gang. But I, I remember he, he did it the wrong way. And it was literally like, I'll be with my gang. Fuck them. And then they were 12, <laughs> gang. And I was cracking up. <laughs> that shit was hilarious. I, I had to like, switch fuck it. Fuck them. Like, <laughs> I'll be with my gang. Fuck I them. I do that all like, the time. I'll be with 12, <laughs> gang. You know, it's so funny, actually. You suck, so like, blood. That's bro, I'm the worst nigga at ad libs. I, no, no, I tell no. these niggas all the time, bro. Remember that one time? Like, like, you're just supposed to like, like I have the best ad libs. I feel you, but I do that, and these niggas have to cut it up and place it right for me. I have the best yeah. ad libs ever, nigga. She wants. <laughs> yeah, shit. Seriously. I swear. Who do you feel, do you feel like does have like the best ad libs like, in like, Ski Master Slump Girl. Right? Uh, yeah. What? Yeah. Now, he has some raw ass ones for sure. Uh, Oh, there's a lot like of people Dex, actually. Yeah. Uh, Dex be killing yeah, shit. Yeah, Dex is out of oh, yeah. life. Travis Scott, Cardi, shit. Cardi, because this shit is so like consistent. Like it's it's like another set of lyrics behind his fucking. Bro, and it, like, like he literally lets a minute ride, and it's like what? Yeah. What? Okay. And it's just like, yeah, that's a good song. <laughs> I don't even that think about it. Like, it's even like you're a, saying that dumb shit like that. No lie, you the don't king even got a jam Chief Keef, bro. That nigga was the first nigga that we were like. Bro, like, oh, he would say a shirt. whole line as an ad lib. What was that one line, though, that he says, like, nah. no, nigga, I'm talking about he says a whole line, Bye. like, oh, I'm posted on the block. Yeah, you know, I'm posted on the block with them. And then, oh, like, oh trouble. Fuck, nigga. Trouble, trouble. <laughs> 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 no, Gucci man, Gucci he man. He does that shit, too, oh, but, like, nigga, his ad lib is a whole line. So hard, bro. 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 My name's Weirdo, oh, you, know, you know exactly who the fuck I am. That was the best one. That was the best one. Remember when he split that one? Which one? Like, he says every time I, I run up down the block, they see me, and then his adams. You know who the fuck I am. No, you know exactly who the fuck I am. Nigga. <laughs> Yeah, I remember one crazy. time I was freestyling, and these niggas, they were they feeling it, and I'm recording, and I, and I stopped, I was like, yo, nigga, I just sound like Slim Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Yo, that shit was I was, was like, like something, my fucking gang. This nigga, I was sounding oh. just like Buddy. I was like, hell no. Nah, it was the stop. day that no, Slim Jesus song came out, yeah, practically. I stopped, nigga, I and he was just right freestyling, <laughs> and he had a notice, but then he's just like, hey, no, bro, that whole shit was Slim Jesus. Deleted the whole thing right there. And you didn't remember no. the one that they barred out was. No, it was that one. Know what yeah. Yeah. No, look, look, look. You know. This nigga spins some real drill shit, and everybody in the room feels him. Everybody's like, "Damn, bro, this nigga's going to fuck in." He stops and he's like, "Yo, I sound like fucking Slim Jesus." <laughs> everybody died. That shit was hilarious. So it's just like him and, and, and hey, but, uh, so look, I got I got my name weirdo from like a. From a Gucci man lyric, like back in the day, I think it was abnormal on like Mr. Zone uh, Six. Normal. And it's like, for the weirdos. <laughs> and in the background, he just keeps saying weirdo. And I was like, bro, that's the hardest. And then he thing. actually dropped weirdo. And then he dropped the song weirdo, weirdo. yeah. But was like weirdo. at the time, I already, weirdo. as soon as I heard that shit, I was like, I was looking for a rap name type shit. And like, I wanted something to do with money, though. Some shit like that, you know, like you're yeah. just a kid, you're just oh, coming no. up with shit. Oh, okay. And I was like, weirdo. Like I just put two and two together, and that's what the fuck came out. He got his name. I, well, I thought it was from uh, from that Gucci Man freestyle back in the day. That like, he's like, I'm gonna keep <laughs> Boulder Chris and Flat Show, and like that's all they talk about. I start nah. Yeah. But honestly, like, there's so many different ways I could have got my name, but it's mostly because of him. But to me, it was there. There was one nigga we used to fuck with. He was the blackest nigga we knew. Oh, I'm talking shit. about. He was that black. Like, <laughs> like, bro, I'm not even kidding, bro. Yeah, so we called man. him Flat Black Rick. <laughs> Yo, this is he the first hated time. that name, bro. This shit get exposed. Yeah, he for real. Don't even know that we call He's him probably that. gonna get hot that I'm saying this, but I don't give a fuck, bro. Shout he hated him, bro. that name, dog. He hated that name. But I fucked with it so much that like I fucked with it, so I kept flat. flat. Like you feel me? Yeah. So nah, it was like people like people are really harsh on this name. They be calling him fat and fat flat. bitch. Flat. And that that was, was no, me. They call him fat. Because like, me fat growing fuck, up with my dogs, bitch. like, like I'm, I'm not insecure. Like, I've always yeah. been fat. Like, so like niggas would be like, yo, fat bitch, in front of hoes and shit. And the hoes would be like, hey, yo, yo just like, thing, like, bro. It'll literally like, be like, like, so, like, these are my dogs. Like, we rank like each silent. other. It'll be silent. But you it's just like, here. 
Hey yo, you fat bitch. <laughs> and, but, and it's funny because <laughs> niggas don't know. Bro. Niggas don't know. And I'll be like, "What's good, bro?" And everyone be like, "Yo, you just let them call you that." But it's my homeboy. Like, you yeah. feel me? Like, yeah. like I said, like I came around. Joey, I came around and I was just like, <laughs> like "Let me not call Joey. this nigga fat, fat in front of everybody." Yeah, so I just called was him flat. I was like, "Yo, flat." And it came out and then he was flat. You know you're saying that? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. That's what I'm saying. Like, there's different ways, but to me, I felt like it was because of that. Like, that nigga Uh, hated that name so much, and then he started calling me flat, and I let it rock. And he's Ant Dog. They call him Ant Dog, and then we'll just call him Ant Frog. Flat Dog. Yeah, they're just trolling me. I was getting trolled left to right. Like, that's it. It wasn't trolling. It was more like you just felt like calling him something else. Yeah, like... Like... And they, it was never like on some like disrespectful shit, never. I call it like, like fanatic. Cause nigga, you call me a Flat fat anatomy. bitch on some disrespectful shit, and I'm gonna call you out, we're gonna shoot the one. Flat but two. like it's always been on some Flat joking two. around shit. Like I'm, I'm that type of nigga that I could take a joke, like. It's not a big deal. Right, that's so flat like, man, nigga, like, I would yeah, literally so be in funny, school, man. nigga, in front of teachers. And my homeboys open the, the fat door. Fat bitch! They're like, yo, fat bitch, slide. And I'll be like, bro, come on, my teacher's right there, fool. Like, <laughs> and they'll just keep on, like, ah. Your teacher wanna call you that? No, my teacher hey, called yo, me Andal. Fat Andor. bitch! And that nigga Andal, like, <laughs> Like, I've never been called my government, you feel me? Yeah. But, like, I've always, like, teachers always call me Andog, shit. Like, that's pretty much my government. Yeah. Like, to everybody, so like flat was like my nickname. Yeah, G shit. Like you feel me? Nigga, I, so I was like, I that's why I let it rock too. His name is. A lot of people don't know my name. Yo, when is, I met Hank McCoy, bro, I really thought that was his name. That's a good ass name. Like G shit, I still think that's his name. I still <laughs> <laughs> hey, but uh, I'm gonna go ahead and wrap it up. Yeah, don't, don't fetch it. Don't fetch it. Do you guys have any advice you want to tell anyone, like starting out or anything? Do whatever the fuck bro, you want to do. We're still starting out, bro. We're still in the same boat as anybody else. We're just trying to get it like everybody else. Yeah. Um, don't you stay consistent, bro. If, if you're really just starting to stay consistent, bro, like find your own wave, do your own thing, and just do it. Just, just Have do fun. it, dog. Nigga, don't Nike that bitch, man. Just do don't it. let nobody tell you some shit, bro. Like, be a rebel, bro. Do your thing. Gang, gang, gang. shit. You guys have any shout outs? Shout out to Sorta of Human. Shout out to Most Vile. Shout out Metro to Zoo. Shout out to Ain't Nobody Cool. Ain't Nobody Cool. Hell yeah. Sweet. Shout out to BNB Perp and them. Well, shout out everybody. members only, you know what it is. Knife. Knife. Shout out Knife, for real. Yeah. Shout out all my young niggas it's on a the block. <laughs> Killing this. All the old school niggas. Terror all the cycles. Where, where everybody. Where you guys at? Skunk <coughs> Gang on IG or Twitter. It's Skunk Gang 305. Gang dot com. You'll see all our videos. Uh, you can follow us there on SoundCloud and stuff oh, like that. Too, right? We got a YouTube yeah, YouTube's channel. YouTube's on there. Wait. Subscribe. We're just trying to work, man. <laughs> Fuck with us. Yeah. Gang shit. Nice. Is nice. Yeah. 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 Shout, shout out Crack Adams. Shout out the New Miami. Mm. Go jam that new Chico Benz. Candy, Candy Man. 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 Yeah. 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 We got our hit rock, rock but it's all good, bro. It's all good, bro. We you feel me? Alright, so this has been Six Feet with Skunk Cape Gang. Gang, gang. Gang shit. shit.